Europe. Hey, hey, how's it going? All right, we should be live. I slightly twisted my ankle there, but other than that, I think we are all set for a red deer hunt here on Hirschfelden in Hunter Call of the Wild, and we are joined once again by Jackson Beard. How's it going, dude? Oh, it's absolutely fantastic, buddy. Man, I, I know I say this every week, but like this is a highlight for me. I love our streams, man. We get out for a hunt, have a good time, generally make a little bit of silliness out of ourselves, but uh, thanks for having me, <laughs> bud. No worries, guys. If you've not already checked out Jack's Beer's channel, the link to that is in the description below. Be sure to do that. And I think with that, we are going to head off. We are in Jonesdorf, or however that's pronounced. Uh, this little lake over here tends to be quite good. It could be a good way to start off maybe getting a red deer right away. Fantastic. And because of how poorly I did last time, we're going to get to the chat right away. <laughs> <laughs> we must have been, what, 20 minutes into the stream before I got caught up? Oh, yeah, but it happens, man. But yeah, getting buried, it's a thing. It does. <laughs> yeah. So before we have... A bison calling out there. Wow. Uh, before that happens again, we've got a firefighter first on the scene. See what I did there? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> He's a first responder, you know. Indeed. Welcome to the stream, man. Thanks for coming by. Thomas Lynn was next, followed by the hype man himself, Flair. Maz Turkelson is in the, ha in the house as well. I can't English, sorry. Uh, Caleb <laughs> Sears says, howdy, everyone. Rage says, hey. I lost my stuff is here. Keaton Harrow as well. Brian Owens, Ricky the Bose, Big Grizz 10, the newest moderator on the channel. Thanks for coming by, man. Yes, uh, the Phantom Gamer says, hey. Yes, sir. Indeed. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know where that's coming from now. <laughs> <laughs> Ducks and Goose Channel. Hello, hello. Trevor Swick says, hey, what up? Marco Silvestre. Tree says howdy sorry if i mispronounced your name let me know if i did in the chat cell shot gaming us here he says i'll twist your ankle all right uh, <laughs> we wait till after the stream though yeah but you already did a good job <laughs> of it you, mind you you're hiding it well you're not really limping too bad yeah you know Ooh. high pain tolerance there's there's the red deer Ooh, i love red deer yes. flitter <laughs> i know i'm so looking forward to this if we can get a good solid stag i'll be happy yeah, I'll be pretty pumped. I mean, just give me the money. <laughs> yeah, right? Show me the money. <laughs> All right, we've got Garrett Lastman saying, hey, Stace Helfrick is in the chat, as well as Benru and Will Miller. Shadow Technology hit, says, hello, guys. How's it going? All the above outdoors says, hello. Bill Kimball and Wes West are here, as well as Randy Calder and Travis Miller. I might have said that name already. I feel like I said a Miller. Either way, hi. Does that make it Miller time? I? I mean, I'm just, you know, Miller, Miller no, time? It could uh, be. Okay, I'll be back. Oh, no, wait, that's sorry. a yeah. seven or an eight. Ooh, ooh. A seven. Let me just... I think he needs to die. Yeah. He moved. Absolutely. Please. Absolutely. His movement has offended us. Yes. Let's actually call him this way as we continue forward. Andrew Wall says, what's up? Fro is in the chat as well. Long time no... <laughs> Long nah. time no see. I need a nap, man. I am good. Good night. <laughs> night. <laughs> oh, look at that. Oh, even the sevens just look so majestic. I mean, is they there do. a prettier animal in this game? Honestly. I would have to say no. They are just incredible looking, and I don't really have much of a shot there. I might go with the crossbow here. Mm. Very much considering it. Oh, I got nice eyes on him. There you go, buddy. Oh, geez. We're going to get a nice close look at you, aren't we? Oh. Should be a double lung? Yep. Yes, sir. <laughs> Assume the position and go collect your cash. <laughs> <laughs> we probably... Oh, that's another stag. We probably should check consec just because that should be a gold. Yeah, not a bad idea. That was a stag for you? I had the, uh, I had the hide yeah. calling out. Huh. Interesting. Oh, yeah. There, I definitely had a stag warning call up here. And hello, everybody in chat. I see y'all there. Absolutely, it's fantastic, man. See if we can. Oh, I see a bison track there as well. 
Oh, that Very would be interesting. Handy. Yeah, you yeah. know, the way things have been moved around here, I mean, I know we've had it for a little while. I still have a hard time with it. <laughs> you know? Yeah. Just keeping up with everything where animals are. I like the fact that they kind yeah. of move around a little bit, though. I do, too. It keeps it fresh, you know? We, we just yeah. knew where everything was. I mean, we were making videos on hotspots, <laughs> you know? Like, it's nice <laughs> that it's all swapped around. It is. Oh, oh hello. On our right. On our right? Is there yeah, another one? Well, there's another one behind the bush right there, right there. Yeah. Okay. Go for the stag. Yeah. Oh, and we've got a whole bunch of boar coming in, buddy. Do we? No, no bison, sorry. <laughs> you know by <laughs> boar, I mean bison. <laughs> oh, hey. J just a few. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, oh, hey. Oh, Where did a he boy go? on the fly right behind that tree. Ah! Oh, okay. Um... We're um, going to have uh, Charging Bisson. Yeah, I don't want to ruin your zone. And thank you so much, John Johns. He says, love the look uh, of the red deer. Good luck on the hunt. Uh, um, run. Da. Run. <laughs> <laughs> Toto. <laughs> yeah, I'd rather not lose this area. This is a good spot for me. Exactly. To want that hunting pressure three. But oh, it's so tempting. Oh. oh. Almost starting off with a demon deer. We are good on Consex. I'll go grab that level seven that we shot. The other ones are gone, so we're good. Oh, your consecs are good. Atta boy, very nice. Well, let's yeah. see how you did. Tell you what, this is oh. not a bad way for a red deer to land. Oh, ho, ho, ho. yeah. Now that's awesome. Yeah, pretty happy with that. When you get those ones that you can, like, with the crossbow, you shoot them and they kind of stand there for a second. Often they do land in a better position for uh, trophy shots, which is quite nice. There we go. And we got, oh, not a bad gold at all to start off. 856. Almost glitched my game there. Almost crashed, but we are good. Uh, hey, 856 is a beautiful. Yeah, that's the first shot on stream today. I like the cut of yeah. your jib, sir. Yeah, I like the way this is going. Were there any males in that bison group? Yes. Or there was group? There was two threes in, in the overly large boars. I don't know what they're feeding the boars here in Hirschfelden, but I want some. <laughs> <laughs> All right. In that case, I think maybe we can... Hi. Oh. Maybe we can get run over by road here. There is another across the lake. It's just a female. Oh, and there's the Bisson. Yeah. Oh, that's a nine. Holy, look at the rack on that guy. Oh, my God. <sighs> Welcome to my map, Flinter. Welcome to my yeah, map. Yeah, and uh, I'll be honest, this is your map, and I know. Look out. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't ready for that. I was kind of stunned. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Anyway, my map, this your is stream, your map buddy. I'm quite all right. Nah, nah, man. You, you've been after a diamond red deer for so long. I can't. Oh, a long time, but it's okay. It's your stream, but, you know. Are you sure? If you shoot it, it'll still be here for me. Hopefully. Maybe. Yeah, uh, I really hope that works for you. If, the, if this is what we're going to do. Uh, but, oh my god. That's... Are you serious? Oh, yeah. We got uh, more Bisson. Coming out of... Oh, jeez. Yep. Uh, hey, hey, how you doing? Okay, I'm going to stand up and hopefully distract you. Hey, how's it going? Hi. Uh, I'm just watching. Hey. Come on now. I'm going to go slap him on the butt, Flinter. Yeah, do it. Yeah, do it. Hey, ah! Hi. Oh, he got me. Oh, I'm going to die. That's going to be the end of beard. Yeah. There it is. Oh my god, you're just standing still on my screen. Luckily, it's not far from the rod. Oh, jeez. Oh, man. Hey, now that's how we start things off. We get a level 7 nice gold. We get attacked and mauled by bison as we spot a possible diamond red deer that's apparently on a Harley. I'll tell you what, dude. That is one of the biggest racks I've ever seen. And he's trotting away right now, so I'm going to give him a call. I spawned with three quarters health how is that a thing and the bison's they coming back for me like he's <laughs> <laughs> uh, i don't even know what to say 
They're having oh their way with God. me, Flinner. Help. I see that, man. What we need is some sort of way to defend ourselves. I, yeah. Imagine if we had guns or something. Duh. I mean, that would be amazing. Because, you know, <laughs> hunting with spears. It could be a thing, just not recommended. <laughs> yeah. And uh, I do apologize to the chat for not getting caught up, but things have been happening. Uh, still bison trotting around up here, man. I hope that Red Deer is going to come back because I don't know why, but they decided to leave that zone and they just had, had gotten there as well, which is kind of weird. That is a little bizarre. Could it have been the dancing around? <laughs> no, I was far enough away. They shouldn't have heard me. No, nah, he was he was not running. He did just trot off. So I'm going to hang out here until you get caught up. I'll just do a little bit of calling, see if he comes back. Otherwise, we've got some tracking to do already. I'm about 150 out. I'm on my way. Excellente. I'm just getting caught up a little bit in the chat. I do apologize if I've skipped you, but I'm a little bit behind. B Dan the Hunter says, is a 95 kilogram fallow deer a diamond? If there's one on my map, it can be. It'll be very close. Uh, you should definitely try to find it and make the shot. Make sure you're using the right uh, weapon as, as well, because they are classed with uh, blacktail deer. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, thank you to Life of Jake for the super chat. Much appreciated, man. Uh, and God, that sounds so good. Where you don't see them, I'm good to walk still. Yeah. You are good. I'm just crawling around here. I don't want to do too much. I think the last thing I spotted was him. I want to see his track because I'm. I watched Zaggy K take a large diamond red deer, and I, to be honest, this rack actually looked bigger. Oh my goodness. What is yeah. happening? What is going on with my map? I can't even begin to tell you the madness that's been on here lately. I, I haven't done Hirschfeld yeah. in really since. It looks like we were on here once for that one stream. Uh, so, yeah, yeah. It's I mean, it's just been a while since I've been here. Well, apparently you did all the right things before you left because that's stacky, 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 stacky. Lots of need zone stacking, my man. Yeah. And being smart with not shooting three animals in one spot. Guys, if you don't know about that, if you shoot three animals all in the same area, if you get if you get three different pieces of hunting pressure all overlapping, basically in that area of overlapping, any zone will be deleted and zones seem to affect spawning in some way. So if you can help it, if you're in a zone, do not shoot three animals in the same spot. Sometimes you do it for fun or whatever. I do it even though I know it's bad sometimes, but if I can avoid it, I definitely do. You really do have to pick your moments, as Flint is saying, guys. Don't just go all wild. If you're in an area that's loaded with need zones, don't do it. <laughs> don't do it. <laughs> it's not worth it because it takes yeah. a long time to get those zones back. That's right. Okay, I'm 45 up behind you here. Have you seen a track cool, yet? Cool. No, I'm just heading over to where he headed into the trees. Hey, Bowman, how's it going? And War Cub says, work let me out early. That's the way to do it right there. That really was a big looking, a yeah. very big looking red deer. His spread mm -hmm. was unreal. I'll, uh, I'll, I'll arm wrestle you for it. Okay. Okay, here on this rock right here. Oh, okay. No, it's okay. I'll come over there. The rock doesn't move. It takes too long. Yeah, that's true. You could just drag the rock over here. Never really said that term. Rock and roll. I don't know. It's, uh, <laughs> more like rock and stay. <laughs> yeah, that does make a little more hey, sense, hey. actually. <laughs> um, Fro wants to happening. know what... Hmm? Yeah, well, you know. <laughs> kind of loud. Fro wants to know what Super Chat is. It is a way of donating through YouTube, basically. Uh, and it just pops up in the chat. The fun thing about and... Super Chat is the alerts, and Flinder has just got a pile of them. It's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> I, did you ah, watch Zaggy yesterday? <laughs> I, I got to watch some of it last night. Yesterday was an absolute gong show for me. Uh, I've still got to go okay. and finish it. And I'm kind of looking forward to finishing it because I, I heard there was a special treat in there. Mm. There was, and... Uh... Not to spoil things, but Sandra joined, and she she had been playing the Isle earlier. And she had a family of dinosaurs, and at one we were all kind of getting on her because she said I had a family was just the way she phrased it. Uh oh. <laughs> oh geez, check out this weight. 
uh, while you're heading over here, I'll finish this story. We're all just making fun of her a little bit because of the way she said it. And uh, hey to Cameron Gunther, thank you for subscribing and becoming a shooter. It is very much appreciated. Uh, uh, but it, <laughs> uh, somebody said, yeah. Uh, everybody sees that on my screen, right? That's the actual weight. Yeah, um, go to your map. Right <laughs> Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. ah! <laughs> and uh big gris 10 says go get them boys thanks for the super chat man it is very much appreciated uh and we will do our best to drop this guy oh but anyway uh <laughs> sandra had said i didn't kill my family because we kept saying that and i just it was a the way she said it is so funny i might uh, go back and grab that sound clip as a donation alert at some point because it was just so good. <laughs> <laughs> and hey to Gaming Wit Go, or am I mispronouncing that? But thank you so much for subscribing. And it looks like we got a bit of a sub train going on. I saw another name come up as well, which should come up as an alert. Oh, there were two even. Uh, Cody it never G's gets vlogging. <laughs> It's just, it's so much fun. I love it. Thank you for subscribing and becoming a Schuster. We've got a Red Deer Mating call down there, and I have a feeling um, I know who is with it. What the? <laughs> He's following me, man. I'm telling you. Man. Get out of here. Uh, I don't have um, my 600 grain out. I don't think I have time. I'm going to try. Yeah, go for it. 1270 I missed the end of your name WRZ thank you so much for subscribing and becoming a user it is very much appreciated you guys are all tuning in at the right time we are on the tracks of what could be a massive red deer and hey to William Meyer as well thank you for subscribing and becoming a user and I saw another name as well you guys are insane thank you so much for all of the support I uh, I gotta get back on the trail, but these are only fr very fresh, so I think we're. Yeah, I, I don't yeah. know, but I heard I heard that female call down there, so I kind of get the feeling that he's down there. And hey to Andrew Slayton, thank you for subscribing and becoming a shooter. They're right here. Yeah. Don't know if there's a stag there. And hey to Eric Martin as well. Thank you so much for subscribing. You guys are all insane. I really do appreciate all the support. Where could he be down there at the back? He could be. We're oh, gonna I have see to a get stag. A no, that ain't him. Bit of an angle on this here, this one tree. I mean, what a place to put a tree. Jeez. Yeah, right. Who put that there? That ain't even right, man. Nope. There's a five. Not. What I think is a five. There he is. Oh, oh my god. Are you kidding me? He's got two trees on his head. Yeah. I'm gonna give a call. I wish I was a little more hidden. Where are you? Uh, up to your right. Oh, hi. Hey. Hey. Heart rate is going. There he is right there. That's a fantastic angle if he'll stop. Hey. What are we doing here, buddy? I am going to give him a call. Can you see him? Oh, oh yeah. That's not stopping, sir. He's at 50. Oh, oh my God. Uh, I'm not taking that. Not God. worth it. I could hit it, but it's not worth it. Uh, someone just subscribed and I missed it. I do apologize. I think there it is. Trenton Toe, thank you for subscribing and becoming a Schuster. It is very much appreciated. I am shaking like a leaf, man. I am too, buddy. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> I <laughs> Where mean, did he go? Holy. <laughs> and active defense, thank you so much for the super chat. I really do appreciate all the support, guys. Where did he? They're leaving. They are leaving. And, uh. Yeah. Wind is good. Uh, yeah, we're pretty okay in that sense. Guys, I said it in my diamond guide yesterday. You've got to be patient on these. It's not worth rushing that shot. Eventually, we'll, we will have a better opportunity than what we had there. We've got a glitched one here. Do we? It's just standing right in front of me. <laughs> Was it the one that called? No, it's over to my left. This one's like literally 20 meters in front of me. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Just gonna walk on past you then. I don't know what your problem is. 
Um, who said that? Godiga says the diamond red deer just look insane. Yeah, I'd have to agree with that. I have literally um, killed so many on this bloody map and figures that we find one not even five minutes into a stream. Right. Uh, oh. Life of Jake, thank you so much for the 10... Is that euros? Uh, either way, thank you so much for the support. And he says, can I get a shout out, please? Beard, do you think Life of Jake deserves a shout out for super chatting in the chat? Oh, Life if, of Jake. if Life of Jake is looking for a shout out because it's Life of Jake's first time being here in the stream, I think it's a good idea to give Life of Jake a shout out. I, I think he deserves it. I think Life of Jake does deserve a shout out. So Life of Jake, shout out to you and thank you so much for the super chat. Hey, Sean Johns, how's it going, man? And Lock and Load wants to know if a 566 kilogram moose is a diamond. It is not. You're looking at about 587 is the absolute minimum I've ever had personally. You can mm. probably go a little lower than that if you're lucky. But once you get down that low, quite often they're actually a little bit too small. Ah, man, we had him right there, but it just, you can't rush those shots. Mm, no, and he was moving. If he had stopped, I mean, I was looking right oh. down at his spine. He could have died, but. I just happened to, to glance over. Sorry, but 165 people watching here. Guys, you are all insane. Thank you all for coming out to the stream. <laughs> hey, let's uh, forget about the diamond. Let's go shoot some geese. Hey, yeah. Yeah, we, who who wants a oh. absolute max diamond red deer? Uh, what? What? That would be silly. But uh, thank you for bringing geese up, actually. The developers have finally announced when geese are coming to console. Uh, and I don't know the exact details, but basically tomorrow was, I think, Xbox One and PlayStation 4 in the US. And then the 19th was PlayStation in the U EU. And I think they said something else as well i don't know if there was another console there but i know there had to be a difference uh in like the way things are approved and stuff on console so very very soon you all on console are going to get the get the geese as well so hopefully you guys are all looking forward to that i know i certainly am my friend i've been grinding away on xbox and uh to have those geese would sure make that a whole lot more I, well probably quicker i gotta be honest you just get so many coming in in a flock it's ridiculous yeah if you get a good spot it's unreal yeah oh man Whew. i don't have this guy's track anymore but i'm pretty sure i'm just on the entire herd here yeah it's I, I? I did the same thing we're gonna maybe have to poke around and see if we can pick it up yeah quite possibly uh jaeger 1973 wants to know if there's any feral or wild boar in the state i live in extremely rarely we get one up here in PA, but it's it's pretty much non-existent at this point. Um, most of the time, if they end up here, a farmer shoots them or whatever, and they don't get to breed. So we're pretty lucky in that sense, because this uh, here in PA, there is a lot of farmland that would be very much destroyed uh, by Z wild piggies. So we really don't need that. Yeah, hmm. we're pretty fortunate that way ourselves here. We don't really get them. I, I've I've heard that we do have some hogs in the southeast corner of our province from time to time, but they're they're called pretty good. Gotcha. Um, Will Miller, thank you so much for the ten dollar super chat. I really appreciate appreciate that. He says ten dollar holla, holla. <laughs> <laughs> But thank you so much, man. That is very much appreciated. You guys are all incredible. Um, where did that go? Keaton Harl asked if a 100 kilogram fallow deer is a diamond. That, my friend, is a guarantee as long as you can make the shot. If it's and of course, an as long as actual you're 100, and that's the thing. Is yes. It, uh, are you using the zag tactics? Because that'll tell you the exact weight. Yeah, that makes a huge difference, guys. If you don't know anything about it, I just made a video explaining uh, that yesterday if you want to go check it out. Uh, but basically, it allows you to know the exact weight of the tracks, which is why we know this red deer that we've seen a few times but haven't gotten to pull the trigger on just yet is 237.7 kilograms. That is literally 2.3 below the absolute max. So he's probably pretty big wherever he actually got to. Have you uh, found the track yet? All I've got is bison on this side. No, I just kind of realized that we're following bison, so I, yeah. I kind of think we need to swing back a little bit. Let's take a look over yeah, here. 
Yeah, because it's probably in this little mix. We got a need zone here too. You might want to pick up. Cool, cool. Ah! Uh, and Buddha Maxwell, thank you so much for the ten dollar donation. I really appreciate it. He says, "Hey, uh, and Buddha, if you're around, could you just say something in the chat, please? I know you're a sponsor of the channel, uh, and I did make some new sponsor badges. And thank you to Life of Jake." Uh, for the two pound super chat, he says, this symbol is Brit Great British Pounds. All right, I am not too caught up on my international currencies, but thank you once again, and thank you for the educational lesson as well. I'm thinking this herd may have split further up that hill there, bud. I'm starting to wonder if they did. This is a little bit weird. I'm going to check all these tracks. I'm just going to, for the sake of time... Yeah. Kick it into gear here and start uh, mass checking. See all the bison are on this side. Yeah, that's it's a little bit tough to track. But by the way, guys, uh, I don't know about Beard, but uh, I'm pretty sure he's the same way. I don't know the meaning of give up, so we we, we will find this guy, whether oh, yeah. he likes it or not. Oh, yeah. I haven't lost a diamond yet. <laughs> I don't plan on starting. Here here comes an errant red deer. Red? Yeah. Yeah. So that's a decent clue, maybe? Um. But not finding a single track for this diamond in amongst all this makes me think. Yeah, it's a little bit weird. I'm going to head back up where we got his tracks initially. He well could have just spun right back around and went right to that drink zone as well. That's what I'm... Uh, oh, no, here it is here. Here he is right here. Oh, you there got you it? Go. I got his track, yeah. Oh, cool. Let's see. He's at a trot, so you're probably good to run right to... Oh, you're pretty close still. Yes, uh, Buddha has thrown all the emojis in the chat as well as uh, rocking that green gun sponsor badge. Oh, there's Red Deer right there. Oh, they're all right That's here. Five. They're all right here. Oh, I see him. I see a huge rack down there. That dude is all kinds of huge. He's massive. Okay, well, I'm in a great spot. What was that? Uh, SpongeBob. SpongeBob. <laughs> <laughs> but Will Miller, thank you so much for sponsoring the channel and have fun with the emojis and uh, looking good rocking that sponsor badge, man. Very nice. Very good to see. Guys, show this man some love. He does work in this community. Absolutely amazing guy and a great content creator. Um, he's coming up. Well, I appreciate that. Okay, I'm crawling up. What are Can we doing? You, you Schuston, I Schuston, what's happening? He's right here, dude. That's kill uh, shot okay. right there. Oh, jeez. He's gonna go. Um, oh, oh, did I hit the cow? I think I hit the cow. Hey! I kind of hope so. I'm pretty sure I did. You didn't. Really? You, you didn't. <sighs> it's, it's highlighted. Wait, 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 wait. He died right there. Something broke there. I think we're okay. 25 to 50. He's right here. Yeah, I don't know what happened there. I'm pretty sure that was the spine shot. But, okay. Near heart attack. I think we're alright. <laughs> uh, we do need to check in sec just because it's been a while. Did that almost make you die inside? I, I, I am a little dead inside. Yes. Yeah. I do believe that was just some kind of desync because very high bleed rate. Cool. That was not as it was supposed to happen. <laughs> that is insane. Yeah, he is all kinds of huge. We just got to kill one oh. of these other ones to be sure. Oh. Uh, oh. Guys, he is down, and I'm somewhat confident that he is going to have the full bonus. Hello. You were supposed to let me shoot you, ma'am. So throw your guesses in the chat right now. What do you think that beast is going to score? Hopefully all the bonuses are there. Ah, uh, you turned. How dare you? I had this shot. Um. Hmm. Did you hit it? Going to have to... No, it, it turned right at the last second. I was trying to hit it in the neck. Oh, we're running right into pressure. Oh, there's a road here. Let's just hit that. <laughs> yep, perfect. Where did it go? If you get a shot, go for it. I lost it. I didn't even see it. Where? I was, I was looking uphill. It just ran right on through here towards the red deer. Red oh, deer well. would be nice because it uh, 
We can probably chase chance. it down here with that opening coming up. Yeah, I'm hoping so. Guys, I almost threw up when that red deer ran, but... Oh, what the heck? There goes the row. I think I moved just a little bit. Yeah, just like... Just a little. Because what happened, I, I don't know what you saw, and maybe I'm incorrect on what actually happened, but a cow ran in front of him just as I shot. And I must have got either below her neck and into his spine or above her neck and into his spine. And for whatever reason, there was a little bit of a desync or something, and he ran off. Consec is good, man. There are some very high guesses in the chat. I mean, if it's not Hopefully, messed up, I'm going to throw down the 1,000. I, I don't think it's messed up. I think he kind of glitched up the hill after I shot. Because a very high bleed rate, they don't tend to uh, lose any quick kill. Uh, but we will find out. And I do we have enough sky? You can do that little trick where you get a really nice screenshot of the animal. I'm going to try to do that. I think I can do it right about here. Uh, we've got all kinds of guesses coming in the chat. Are you ready? Here we go. Oh boy. <laughs> yeah. Not bad at all. Bonuses are fine. I can barely fit his entire rack on screen. Let's see if anybody guessed it right before I do a reveal. I see some that are very close. Ooh, one very close. All right. 998 if it's not a thousand with that kind of weight oh uh unfortunately you are off by a bit i do see one guess that is exactly correct uh, and that is coming from schmidi or schmidi i really apologize if i'm saying your name incorrectly but the final score of this beautiful level nine red deer is 978 are you kidding with that weight on it yeah, yeah, we got the low trophy rating, unfortunately, but yeah, man. That, that's a terrible rack. Yeah, it should be a low rating. What the heck? W God. killing spree time. Yeah, killing spree time. Rage killing. Be... Yes, I think that's exactly what we should do. We should just go kill absolutely everything because yeah. this should be a nine ninety. <laughs> I, I have an absolute score to settle with those bison that have been stalking me. We need to go and take them apart. You're right. That's a great <laughs> idea. Yeah, man. But holy, <laughs> we're 30 minutes boss. into the stream, and we just dropped a beastly diamond red deer. Yeah, it's not like All we've right. ever done that before. Twice? No. <laughs> Is that yep. the third time or just no? That's the second right in the beginning. But I think together that's got to be between your streams and my streams, like five on stream? Were you with me for the five two on mine? Yeah, it might even be six. That's right. You wow. had a big moose on stream that I was there for. That Wreck and I couldn't get his tracks or something. Um, we've had together on my stream two moose, one whitetail, and a rabbit. Was there anything else? Well, now a red deer. Yeah, that's at least the sixth one then. Jeez. Were, were you only with me for two? I thought you were there... I'm not even sure now, to be honest. I've had a, a good handful on stream as well. It's just, a, oh, you, you gotta love them when you get them on stream. It's just so much fun. Yeah. You get to share them with everybody in chat. Oh, that was amazing. Big round of applause, guys. If you have not already, smash that like button for this man in appreciation of that diamond and do it with two hats if you gotta. I just, oh, the way that <laughs> happened was not ideal. <laughs> but you pulled it off. You, uh, you it pulled worked. it off, yep. Yeah, yeah, I, I, um, mm -hmm, I could have shot. I was looking right at it. I'm like, oh, God, no, dude, yeah. something. <laughs> oh, I just, yeah, I'm glad it wasn't a thousand or, or, or I would have been sad we didn't arm wrestle. Yeah, I, I'm <laughs> I'm somewhat glad that it ended up not being that big because it was on your map. I do no, hope no. that he's going to gonna be around for you at some point to get him uh, on your own at some point. That would be quite cool. Oh, I'll be coming back, guaranteed. Uh, little, little after the stream, I got a little something to do right away, and then I'm coming back to Hirsch, baby. Nice. Hey. <laughs> uh, hey to William Alves or Alves. Thank you so much for subscribing and becoming a Schuster. I see Sandra is in the chat. Hello, hello. Aha, bonjour, Sandra. 
We gotta get her a diamond at some point. She keeps showing up right after people shoot diamonds on streams. <laughs> well, she's a girl. She likes diamonds. We all know this. Uh, exactly. Yeah, we were chatting about that not too long ago the other day. We were all hanging out. I was asking her if she would like to come out sometime and pillage my map with me. Would be kind of fun. Your map seems to be the diamond producing map these days, so that's probably not a bad idea. Hey, watch my video today, buddy. <laughs> I will do that. Mm -hmm. What's that? Mm -hmm. What do you got? Ah, a little tiny road here. Oh, wow. Yeah, not impressed. Just a little one. Uh, oh, yeah. You did shoot the bison. Do you want to make sure your Kinsek's good, or did you check it on the bison? Kinsek was good. Yeah, I got her on the bison. Oh. Alrighty. Um, kind of want to shoot that just because it's there. Well, we, I mean, <laughs> we can do that, sure. I mean, hey, it, it might have fallen off. Shall we double check it with the, the uh, 7 mil? <laughs> I think so. <laughs> Sounds like fun. Let's get a Make good angle die. on this. Yeah, he's, he, he's offending me with those tiny little spikes. I don't know, man. Yeah, that's just, that's embarrassing. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> he got tired. You know what I love when you shoot something like that with an oversized gun and you get the big puff of dirt from behind it where the yeah. bullet obviously hit? <laughs> that's it's fantastic. Great. But, you know, um, I just picked the need zone up there. I guess it's gone now. <laughs> really? Well, there was be. only one animal attached to it, right? Let me double check that, here. That doesn't always delete them. Sometimes it does, but not always. Well, let's see. Uh, go to get was a 263 trophy rating. What a sad little deer. <laughs> yeah. Oh, and I missed firefighter having to go to a house fire... Hope that all goes well, man, if you're still around listening. Uh, good luck. Oh, look, some guy uh, harvested a 978 red deer just uh, not too long ago. Hmm, very nice. Very nice indeed. Mm. Yes. 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 <laughs> Wait, what what <laughs> happened to that huge pack of bison we were following? I don't know. We got all distracted. They were... They were just tracking us the entire time, and then yeah. something with trees on its head showed up and. Ah! <laughs> uh, active defense. Thank you so much for the two pound super chat. He says, "Can you give me some tips for leveling up?" Uh, basically, you want to shoot everything you can. Try to get those spine shots, as they'll be more effective for dropping. And if you're on console, uh, once those geese are dropped, I would really recommend grounding those. They yes. will get you some XP pretty dang fast. Yeah, not to mention the 20 gauge is just a whole lot of fun. It certainly is. I love that gun. Mm -hmm. It's my favorite shoddy now. I mean, I used to love the Kajitori. Kind of made me think of dinner. But having that pump in the six shots was a beautiful thing. But that tw that 20 gauge, man. Oh, yeah. yeah. It's... It's a very satisfying gun to shoot, and they all look so good as well. They do. They really, really do. And the names are pretty cool. Was it Streka? Fiona? Isn't it Fiona is the other one? Is that yeah, right? and Raven. And Raven, that's right. Fiona, I think, is the white one, right? That's my favorite. Yeah, mm. I love that one. I'm so glad they did the, the full white. She's pretty. Oh, well, hello. She really is. Hey. Hey. So, I don't know, do you hunt this? I'm going to ignore that. Do you hunt this lake up here that we're heading to next? Yes. I love this little this little lake right here. Is I used to come down off of the hill and go to this lake. This was my circuit before it all changed. Mm -hmm. And I don't get out here as yeah. much as I used to. I, I can't get off of Leighton these days, man. I, with the I need zone know. stacked. <laughs> Layton's a insane map. Um, just so you know, we're gonna go find another level nine ra uh, red deer up here. Uh, but anyway, <laughs> <laughs> probably. Oh, Thunder Master wants to know what was your biggest animal in the Hunter overall. If you've not seen that video, I really oh. do recommend going and checking that out. I was with this man once again. Oh. We had a coyote 
uh, on his map. And it sure gave us the runaround, but in the end, it was well worth it. And oh. we took down a 1,000 scoring Kayak. It was utterly amazing. I, I can't begin to tell you the fun we had on that hunt. I mean, we had Guide Emperor Jay, Sean Johns, yourself, myself, and uh, the teamwork. And oh, it made the dream work, baby. It was awesome. It did. When you've got a group of guys like going out and searching for an animal like that, when it when it when you can't find its tracks or whatever, it just makes everything so much more rewarding when you actually get it. And oh. we pretty much needed all four of us by the end of it. Yeah, yeah, it was really good. And not to mention the the kill shot. I mean, it was dark. Uh, it was a ways yeah. out. It was awesome. Like just everything about that. It's by far one of my favorite videos on YouTube. Uh, on a close second of that uh, incident down by the lake with uh, AFK <laughs> and stuff. Yeah, yeah. I, I <laughs> happened to stroll by that video the other day and watch it again. That's just, I love that. <laughs> it was awesome, man. I never that forget was... it. Never forget it. it just... <laughs> <laughs> I just thought of this. Isn't it amazing? Two of our favorite memories. That was the same night. It was. The exact same. I, you know what's funny as well? That day, uh, I was privy while well, we had two diamonds that day. Mythicals. Uh, it's one of my favorite hunt videos that I did. And I included a little bit of yours in there too. It's actually, that video, was, uh, I've had lots of people comment on that one. What a fun hunt it looked like. That was a full day of hunting. Followed with a stream. It was, it was Reiki's stream that we were at, or yeah. I went to. <laughs> it was. Oh, man. Fantastic. Oh, God. So much fun. But I, in the entire making of the AFK video, I, because this is when I had like two diamonds total, I had every intention of calling it Why Flinter Never Gets Diamonds. And then I just killed the biggest diamond you can get. And I was like, well, what am I going to do with this? Oh, and that was the start of it. <laughs> and now you just haven't let up, man. I mean, you've just crushed it with the diamonds, buddy. Absolutely crushed it. Speaking of crushing it, I saw this, and I don't want it to get too far off screen. It's all the way up there, but I, I'm curious because this often changes. I see Thundermaster has asked what your favorite gun is, and I know from time to time, like we all kind of move around on that. What is your favorite gun in Call of the Wild now, Flinter? Right now, I have to give it to the seven mil. It's just Ooh. the integrity on all the big species. It can take down the bison without really any problems. You've got the range; it's so accurate. There's not really anything negative you can say about it. Hello. Did you see that guy move? Uh, stop your movement. You, you, oh, you was lucky. I was going to tell you, you better beat me to it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's another well, stag. Well. This is a good hunt. I like this. Yeah, it's turned out pretty good. Uh, I, I need right to really... Sorry? I can see him. He looks like a six. Oh, okay. he's a seven. Not too bad. Yeah, seven. Oh, well, what? he's all yours, man. Oh, yeah, I see that rack. Yeah, it doesn't look too shabby. If I could get him on a, preferably not through the ground. Yeah, that wouldn't be ideal. Uh, let me actually change. If he comes close enough, I'll take him with the crossbow so we don't just destroy this area. Nice and hey to <laughs> Jeremy Graves. Thank you so much for subscribing and becoming a shooter. You guys, the support today has been insane. Uh, thank you all so much. I really do appreciate that. I I'll tell it. you what, man, those sevens. Yeah, they they're look impressive. great. They sure do. By the way, Jeremy was also on a Harley. I, I it's, you know, sounds like a good guy. Uh, yeah. Virtual bike club, you know. Yep. <laughs> Park it anywhere, baby. Okay, so I'm going to move up to this tree because it's in the way. It's a thing. Noise. I'll just stay back here and read the chat. Night Rocker says, congrats, epic Monday hunt and smiles. I just uploaded a sick long distance hawk edge video. Wow, that thing is amazing. I love the hawk edge. I really need to crack it out some more. But man, the crossbow, how can you not? I know, right? Oh, we've got another one. I didn't think that was him. We got... Is it, well, we got the seven in front of me here. I don't know what else is down there, but it's barking away. Yeah, I'm trying to sneak to where I can see and not actually be leaving my cover, but we can track that. We can't really shoot him here anyway. We'll uh, have too much hunting pressure. 
Uh, Thundermaster says, I bought one of your t-shirts. Well, I do appreciate that. I hope you enjoy getting to wear that. Man, look at that rack. Oh, I thought I would have got him right in the... Oh, that was terrible. I should have went straight for spine. <laughs> well, I thought I could pop him right and get through that bone there. What did you go for? Uh, I went for uh, right at the spine where it meets the neck, right at the shoulder, basically. Oh, okay. I bet it only gave me flesh wound. Unfortunate. Yeah, but I'm curious what that other guy is down there. Yeah, I'm going to get take a peek. They can't all Luckily, be good shots, so you don't know what a bad shot is, right? Yeah. Well, I'll tell you what, I almost knew what a bad shot was earlier. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's all good, buddy. You made it, and it worked. Need it zone here? Work. Oh, this was a 198, so that'll be a level 6. I shall come get Zen Need Zone. Uh, Willy Boy Kelly wants to know, what is my dream thousand scoring animal? It is still a whitetail. I got very close, although I had to intentionally mess it up a little bit. Uh, for the challenge I was doing, but that guy would have been 993 if I uh, actually did get him correctly. Challenge ain't worth it. <laughs> Sorry, don't mess up a white I, tail. What are you doing? Hey! <laughs> I was having all kinds of struggles, and that Fortnite player 97, thank you so much for subscribing and becoming a Schuster. It's very much appreciated. You guys are insane today uh, with all of these support. Are you following that guy? Yeah. Yeah, I think that's the glitch showing me the heavy pressure right there off the one kill. Oh, and is it? He's dropping, though. He's at 50 to 75. Go, oh, man. Uh, okay. Hopefully we spine. can find some. Yeah, he's not going to get too far. Hopefully. There he is right there. He's all uh, piled up. Big old rack sticking up. Yeah, somewhat. Yeah, not bad. Uh, Sandra says, I'm getting jealous I never find red deer on my map. Well, that's why you got to come out with us, you see. Well, Sandra, come on. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you do hey, have you a two. train going. <laughs> it is. It's just nonstop. Uh, Yee Yee Squad, thank you so much for subscribing <sighs> and becoming a Schuster. It's very much appreciated. I've got a level. That's a six? Look, I just missed six that, Six with buddy. a five rack. Look at the stream. Just Look how it. close. Yeah, I just missed the spine right at the end. Went a little high. <laughs> oh, it hit the scalpula. There's a swimming dog in my way. There it is. Oh, yeah. Dang. <laughs> right? <laughs> oh, well. Win some, lose some. Yep. Uh, I don't think I should shoot this guy. Or should I? Uh, it's getting too close to putting level 3, and he's only a level 6. He's not even a big level 6. Not, not worth we'll the pressure. See. Yeah, exactly. We'll see if there's anything on the far side of the lake, maybe. Uh, William Meyer wants to know if I hunt reindeer with these 7mm. I very much do. Mm -hmm. Uh, just... I don't remember... I, I've got a video coming out that we did... Uh, Zaggy and I did a hunt on Medved where I shot a reindeer somewhere around 300 meters away and dropped it, but I can't remember if I edited that already and if it's going to be uh, in the video or not, because it might end up being two videos. It was a rather long hunt, but anyway. Uh, gotcha, yeah, gotcha. great gun for reindeer. Hey, I see uh, Craig McMillan was asking if he yeah. missed anything. <laughs> I just caught that. Uh, you might want to go back about 20 minutes. Just, uh, maybe. <laughs> Well, but then you might miss the next one that's coming up. So maybe wait till the end of the stream and just watch up till now. <laughs> that's true. You it was gorgeous, well. Craig. It was gorgeous. Indeed. <sighs> um, so I'm curious, my man. Do you use the 338 much these days? The only time I'll carry the 338 is if I'm going on a hunt for bison and nothing but bison. Otherwise, I'll just use the 7 mil even when I'm shooting the bison. Uh, on this map, just... It, I have that loadout of four weapons that I use, and that is just, I don't change them. Really? Even when you're out on the moose, eh? Yep, I'll use these 7 mil pretty much exclusively on the moose. I don't use the crossbow on moose because I really, I don't know, I struggle to drop them. And uh, Avery Nolan, thank you so much for subscribing and becoming a Schuster. It is very much appreciated. Uh, yeah, I, I don't know what it is about the crossbow with moose, but I keep messing it up. 
I have a hard time with uh, Moose with the crossbow. Off and on. Sometimes it, it works, sometimes it doesn't. I'm just such a huge fan of the 338. I, I really push max integrity per animal uh, just because I've yeah. had issues. Issues. I've had issues. Yeah, I, I was fully in the 338 camp for a long time, but I just got sick of switching my weapons, to be quite honest. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, so it's not any, like, it's just preference for loadout. It's nothing to do with, like, uh, the gun yeah. itself performance. Okay. I was just curious when you when you mentioned that, because I used to be a huge fan of the 7mm. I, I, I still quite like it. Uh, I just, I, you know me, I hunt a lot of moose. I just love my niece. And I've, it's yeah. let me down a few times. And uh, I, yeah. you know, eh, eh. It's gotten me on at least one occasion, which uh, some of you have probably seen. Uh, that was in Zaggy's video, but eh, I don't know. It, the problem with it for me actually right now is it doesn't fit in my current loadout. I've got the 7 mil 44 crossbow and 223 is actually too heavy to fit. Uh, so I can't really make that work. And I just saw this farmer vlogs. Thank you so much for subscribing and becoming a shooter. There are all kinds of new shooters today. Hey, hey, I'm working well, on uh, that. I just can't do it. It just is not the same, man. <laughs> yeah. You gotta like trademark that, copyright that stuff. I, sh I should actually. By the <laughs> way, uh, I think we should go get some revenge on Bison. There's nothing up here. Yes, I concur. Let's do it see if there's anything hanging out down here uh yeah as mrs b said chicken nugget we've still got over an hour to go tegan lauren's vlogs and gaming wants to know what map do you recommend starting on i would say Leighton lake without a doubt you can pretty much take everything with that 243 if you know what you're doing uh and at least up to the deer and you just get all kinds of deer to level up and gain your xp although now with the geese you got yeah. the shotgun somewhat early in the game that might actually be a thing uh, that you should worry about. You just got to be able to afford some decoys and stuff. So maybe start on late and get some cash and then just go straight to uh, geese hunting. You'll level up in no time. Yeah, it seems to be the way to do it. And I mean, rabbits are a good option too, but not being able to call them until you get the who's deer. Yeah. It's, mm, yeah. yeah. I'm a big fan of the I, geese. I've been enjoying them. I just uh, want to see them released and solid. And yeah. Yes. They're very cool. I, it's obviously the most unique species in the game. He just brought up rabbits. I bet I haven't shot a rabbit since I did that video uh, on my loadout, which was close to a month ago now. Oh, jeez. I, I, I have just... a lot of fun with them, but yeah. I, do you really carry the 22 just for the rabbits? I often bring exactly. my crossbow, and it's then just not the same. Close. Yeah, you take more time, and all those meese I could kill in that time. I'm just saying. <laughs> yeah. Uh, there's a good question. Christian Wonder wants to know, do you think you should have a setup option for certain maps? Like when you go to a map, you don't have to get your inventory to switch calls and weapons. Yes, I do think we should have that. We have mm -hmm. preset loadouts in the Hunter Classic. And yeah, that would change my loadout because uh, I, the reason I don't change it is because it takes too long having to put the gun in and the ammo and then the scope. And uh <laughs> Uh, the last stream what well it's just funny because I, you play a lot of hunter classic and so you're spoiled that way having those options whereas myself i mean i've always had to toss them around i never really look at it like that too often although i can yeah. see your point <laughs> it's absolutely valid hmm, hmm. I'll, I'll be honest though one thing that actually really makes a big difference for me is the last stream we did here on Hirschfeld, and do you remember my 7mm wouldn't work? Yes. Because I accidentally put the wrong ammo in it. Sometimes it allows you to do it, and I saw a screenshot uh, on, it was in Zaggy's Facebook group, somebody shot a massive diamond moose, it was like a 230 trophy rating, uh, but they said they shot it at 200 plus meters with a 223, which they did, uh, but it was a straight spine shot, so they had very obviously managed to glitch it and put some other kind of ammo in the gun. Right. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. I've heard of that happening. Yeah. Well, you but think it, that it happened can to happen. You? It, with the seven mil? It did. Yeah. Yeah. That's that's what you did then, was you had the wrong one. Okay. And I'm I pretty had the sure. I green bolts loaded in it. <laughs> oh, there's uh, that row that I just spotted was a 30. I mean, it'd be a solid gold. 
Uh, okay. I did actually see him running off. Didn't look too closely. I don't... If you got a shot, go for it. I can't see him. No, I can't see him. I just... I saw his track. He was 30 kilogram. Uh, okay. We already spooked him. Uh, went. It's not like we're gonna... You know, there's a road. Yeah. Like, you know? <laughs> We've got bison to get revenge on anyway. Yeah. Uh, this farmer vlogs wants to know if pistols are worth using. Pistols are fantastic. They've got great penetration. I actually see him down there. He does have oh, a solid yeah. rack. Yeah, not bad. Is that worth it? Uh, you... you got the 243. I do. You'd be better off than me. I can call him and try to turn him around. I, I mess up road here with the 223 constantly. He's at an awkward. Yeah, I'm gonna see if I can get him to turn. Oh, all right. <laughs> well, I thought I could nail him. I'm just not on today, buddy. It's all good. Um. Oh, Jacob Gregson <sighs> wants to know why this is not my perspective, and that is because my internet is too slow. And before I forget, 28 Flavian, thank you so much for subscribing and becoming a shooter. I really appreciate the support, man. Uh, yeah, my internet is too slow to stream myself, so Jaxie Beard uh, has pretty much volunteered to do third-person streaming for us, and it is very much appreciated, and if you've not checked out his channel, I really, re really recommend you do so, especially with the video that is coming out tonight. <laughs> yeah, I've got to uh, do the SEO and upload right after the stream, but yeah, man, I'm, I'm pretty, uh, pretty pumped about this one. It was a really fun hunt. Yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing that. I know a few details that... Uh, I'm not going to spoil. Um, I like Tiger wants to know what about letting people make mods? Um, I, that would bring people to the game. I'll say that. It would. I mean, any game that goes to mod support typically keeps that game alive, even when content gets stale and such. So, uh, yeah. tough one, tough one. Boar, low, lots of boar actual boar <laughs> yep yeah right in front of us time to do a spotting fest i nothing uh... all females not a single male though here comes another one two yeah. minor and another one <laughs> one trivial I'll, I'll cut off the two minor and get it with my car why did you guys stop oh, and that stupid roe deer died oh did it uh... oh no yeah oh there we go stop one coming? <laughs> stop Come i here. say stop Kinda wanna hey. oh hit him. Shoot him. Yeah. Make him dead. <laughs> <laughs> Come back. What is just the one trivia? Hey, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. What are uh, we doing? I don't know. I really should go pick this stupid road here up. I'm not gonna have good yeah. We can go check for bison and see if there's anything at this lake and then we can kind of decide where yeah. we go from there if you want. Not really too worried about it, to be honest. If we do happen to see something, I need my consec. You know, it, it's a thing. It can happen. It is. Uh, William Meyer wants to know if I recommend the 454. Uh, very much so. That gun is insane. The only reason I don't carry it is because it doesn't uh, actually fit in my loadout. It's a little bit too heavy, but... It's incredible. It's a great gun to carry if you're doing like some kind of bow hunting where you need something that can take down large game. I, while I was doing this, I was hunting with the 270 a lot uh, for moose. But if I had a long range moose shot, I would use the 454, which makes no sense where I'm using the shorter barrel pistol for a long shot. But that's what I would do because it's just so powerful. Hmm. No bison. Not yet. No. No be son. Oh, hey, hey. Someone's building stuff again. Yeah, isn't it strange that it's certain spots uh, that cause it? Yeah. I've got facts here. Boar truck? Oh, no. Be son. Yes. Unless that's a very large boar poop. I mean, it could be a baby boar for the size of it. There, over here. That's Yay. true. Meeting Let's just head on out. over here. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, while we're Might. doing that, I should put my 600 greens on. Oh, that's a grand idea, actually. Mm -hmm. I shall do that. Uh, Keaton Harl says, hashtag Flinternet. Yeah, pretty <laughs> much. <laughs> I see Saucy Fry is asking if there's any good geese spots. There absolutely are. Pretty much any of the fields. Do you have a particular spot in mind, Flinter, that you prefer? 
I see a bison. Um, I'm trying to think of who it was. I want to give credit to who told me the spot. Zeus3164, thank you so much for subscribing and becoming a Schuster. I I actually hunted with the guy who uh, showed it to me, and I cannot for the life of me think of his name. Uh, but up in Ritterstein, he had a setup there. It was nuts. Just constant flocks of geese coming over. Yeah, they seem to do a big circuit. And so depending where you are and when they're doing that circuit, you know what I've done and works really, really well. Uh, I typically get geese. I don't wait more than much than five minutes. I set tents all the way around. Uh, I like to yeah. jokingly say a bearded pattern, but uh, right <laughs> here, <laughs> just like that. Hey, hey. You can see them all right there. And it just works so well. Well, hello. Hey. How you feeling? I don't know. I kind of want to see if there's any males. We didn't have any male tracks, though. There was a three in the back. Oh, was there? But, I mean, we can okay. catch them. We're going to take this whole herd, buddy. <laughs> yeah, we could try. They did try to get us. I've got no health. If I get run... Oh, hey. I didn't know you were beside me. If I get run over, I am very dead. Yeah, um, I could take a couple of hits. Hold on. Let me put on a red cape. I, I got this. Yeah, I'll get behind you. Okay. All right, I'm ready. Um, Stace wants to know what is my favorite animal call in Call of the Wild. <laughs> uh, that's a great question. I mean, as far as realism goes, or as far as giggles go, because there's some pretty funny sounding callers. I, mean, I got to be honest. The musk, the musk deer, the actual animal itself. <laughs> yeah. That's the best one. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not surprised you said that. <laughs> <Really>? <laughs> Uh, I, I I gotta tell you, I'm a big fan of the elk caller. It's obnoxious, obnoxiously loud, yeah. but it's legit. I mean, that's what they sound like. Yeah, it's it's rather accurate. Uh, hey to me, Elison. I'm probably saying your name wrong. Sorry if I did. Let me know how to pronounce it correctly in the chat if I have mispronounced it. But thank you so much for subscribing and becoming a Schuster. There are so many new Schusters today. That's fantastic. We have a Schusting army. Ooh. Um, X01007 wants to know if I've tried the 4570 rifle. Not too much. I have uh, put some shots out with it. I don't know. I, I'm not a huge fan of it. Hopefully, Flair's not here to attack me for saying that. But, um, <laughs> it's a it's a good enough rifle, but it, it kind of lacks the power that I think it probably should have. Yeah, they need to fix it. No, it's, it's it's nothing like it is in real life or in other games. I mean, you can attest to that. You quite like it in Classic, don't you? Yes, the, yeah. it's insane in Classic, especially the Buffalo Rifle, which is an older variant of the same caliber. Yeah. Oh, I love that gun. Um, I mean, all the above outdoors, it was James Monty who gave me the Ritterstein spot. Thank you for reminding me of that. Just while you're talking about the 4570, during a stream, we were hunting bison. I was about 20 meters away, and a roe deer came out. And I thought, oh, okay. I saw that. Yeah. I know what you're going to say. 20 meters away, and I shot it in the shoulder, and it stopped the bullet. <laughs> <laughs> what? I mean, I used the 338 on that, and the thing goes flying. I, yeah, exactly. Should be the same, you know? <laughs> Well, not quite just, the same. The 338 has got more pack of a punch, but still. Yeah. Um, This farmer vlogs wants to know what green bolts I use. It depends on the animal uh, all for the integrity. There's apparently 11 here. Where were they all at? Uh, up on this grassy knoll here. You know what happens. Oh, never mind. I shouldn't say that. But, uh, yeah. Uh, <laughs> hey, look. Yeah. Over in the distance. No. Nope. The road here? No. Nope. No, I'm just uh, changing subjects. There you go. No. Oh. Yep. Where'd okay. they go? Which confused. direction have they had? There they are right here. We're putting them into our wind. Oh. There's a three easy Thanks. right there for you, bud. All right. Wouldn't mind getting that with the crossbow, but I don't think I'm getting that close. Oh, you Should I shoot? use the seven mil then? Go for it. All right. See if I get... Yeah, that angle's a little better. Or you can just... Yep, just keep on turning, buddy. Yep. Yep, oh. walk by the tree. No. That's exactly what I wanted. I can hit that. Hey, he moved. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. He will take Jeez. us to his leader. 
You or will. you can put another one in them. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Did I get it? I'm not even... I yeah. couldn't see. Looked like it. Oh. Yeah, he's yeah, laying he down. down there. He's a little tired, Cute. Flinner. He wanted to have a bit of a dirt nap, so he's... Uh... Yeah, well. Hey, 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 hey. Jeez, man. D d d did Sometimes. You hear that? Yeah, it's a jump scare. It is. <laughs> There's gophers up in them trees building it. See, people That's don't understand... They don't understand that, you know. I mean, after streaming for so long with a bomb... You just, you got no idea, guys. <laughs> it I'll makes tell you, you jumpy. Man, yeah. Stupid stuff makes me jump now. <laughs> I know. I know, man. I'll be on the job site sitting in my machine. And, you know, there'll be a loud noise out there. I'll jump. And people, will, you know, the guys working around me will laugh. What's wrong with you? Now then. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> Didn't you hear the bomb? <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> oh, man. It'll get you. Yeah. Well, uh, it, sorry. <laughs> I just wanted to bring attention to Buddha Maxwell mentioning that there is a spreadsheet made by Nodor for all the integrity uh, and all of the stuff you need to know. There's also one made by Godiga that is specifically centered around getting those diamonds. So uh, right below that, Mass has linked the Discord uh, invites. So if you want to join that and know all there is to know about everything in the world. <laughs> Be sure to do that. <laughs> oh man, I'm curious if those bison that herd that was there looped around to go back to that need zone. I lake. don't know, man. They're all Not that it would do us any good. We got some big, big pressure there, but still. Mm. Yeah. I, if only there was a bigger one in the group. To make it worthwhile, absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> yeah and uh hey to zachary johnson thank you much thank you so much for subscribing and becoming a shooter i just heard a bison male mating call so maybe we're going the right way anyway <laughs> mass just said he, he was actually in chatted with me when i was working when <laughs> that day when i jumped oh man <laughs> You heard that mating call, eh? It was funny how you said if there'd be a bigger one, and then we get a male bison calling back. <laughs> right? He's like, hey, I'm over here. Yeah, right? No, Buddha. We don't love the bomb. No, no. Yeah. No, no. We'll have to, <laughs> we'll have to crack that out again sometime, though. Uh, in the near future, hopefully. Yes. It's been a while, actually, on this channel. What's calling over here? Uh, we got a red deer behind us. How do we what? walk by him? I don't know. Mind if I take a look? Oh, please do. I'm not allowed to shoot any more red deer on this map, I'm pretty sure, so... <laughs> uh, Will Miller, thank you so much for the $5 super chat. He says, we need more bacon. Yeah, it's always a good idea, actually. Oh, he gets to use the uh, flinter emoji in these uh, super chat messages as well. That's actually kind of cool. That might be the first time I've seen that. Oh, that is kind of cool. What a nice option. Very, very nice. And, you know... It's really a great way to help support your favorite creators. Sponsoring the channel, man. Getting all those little perks and stuff. Oh, he's ah! right here. Bacon. Bacon. <laughs> uh, yeah. Non-inspirational gaming making an entrance. Thank you so much, man. He says, can't stop on the way to work. Have a good hunt. Uh, we are very much in the process of doing that, actually. <laughs> Don't worry about it. He was a small little guy. And he went. He <laughs> came right up into the wind. There was no... Good. It's not... It's not good when you go to look at an animal and just come running away from it. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, it was small. <laughs> it was real small. Oh, God. Uh, Keaton Harl says the rabbits are hard to find now because moose are everywhere. Yeah, I mean, every update seems to mess with spawns a little bit. I'm sure that's intentional to try to keep things, I don't know, keep things moving, keep things different. I but think so, it, yeah. Just... Right when you think, all right, I got this figured out. Nope, there's Moose and Belmont now. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Which is, you know, at first, I didn't know what I thought of it. I was like, what the heck? That's not right. Belmont's for deer. But I, I got to tell you, I kind of like it. Yes. That little red deer. Same one. Out. What the yeah. heck? Probably should have shot it. Um, That's an awfully strange At a trot. At a trot. That's, <laughs> that's something else right there. <laughs> what? Just, just hauling through the forest, a little goose. 
I just picture running okay. around Aflac, yeah. <laughs> just bouncing around. <laughs> that would be so funny. That needs to be a Halloween th or an April Fool's thing. You oh. say an Aflac. That would be great. I'm sure EW could work something out like that with them, man. I mean, it's advertising, you know? <laughs> it, yeah, right? That's actually a good point. They, could, I mean, if nothing else, at least make our caller say Affleck. Oh, that would be so funny. TK, if you're watching at any point in time. <laughs> oh, Do that, it. that would be classic. A 662 it was probably what called at us. Uh, yeah, there's another bison Hello. track here I want to check. Kevin Michael has a question. Some days it seems like there's tons of animals, and other days there's nothing mm -hmm. uh, that's on Xbox One. Well, on the days that there's tons of animals, I'm assuming that you're shooting tons of animals. And basically, actually, do you want to explain that? Because you're kind of the one that came up with that, the three-day thing. Yeah, once you've shot an animal, you got to give them a chance to respawn. They don't seem to respawn the next day, although they can do. There is a little bit of a variance there. Get off my beard, man. Uh, so <laughs> tip, typically what we've just, what we've found that works is after you've killed something, whether it be like a nice juicy level for a moose or perhaps a diamond, do a three-day cycle. So head to your outpost, swap it by three days. So if you want to set it for, say, 7.05, the next day do it at 7.04, and then at 7.03. Do it three days, go back out, and I'm telling you, nine times out of ten, we've found them again. So that it's not guaranteed they're always going to respawn, but it really does seem to get results. It certainly does, and look at you guys taking initiative. I was going to ask that question uh, for everybody, boot ass that I believe... Uh, asking where is everyone from, and you all just started rolling with it. I mean, that's because so, is the man, buddy. I don't know what to say. Exactly. <laughs> Stream vet right there, you know. <laughs> he knows. Stream vet. I love it. Oh, that's another. I almost said a bale mice and track. A bale almost. mice and... <laughs> it's a thing. Let's, let's go find the bale mice and... Um... Anyway. <laughs> oh, clicking buttons that I'm not meaning to click. These things happen. It's quite all right. Yes. All right, we've got... I still don't know if I'm mispronouncing your name. Is it just me uh, from Norway? I'm sorry if you told me that I mispronounced it somewhere in the chat and I missed that. Uh, but we've got Stephen Horn from Louisiana. Big Grizz from Tennessee, Mrs. Beard from BC, Canada. Speaking of which, where are you from? Me? Yeah. Uh, I'm from Mrs. Beard. Okay. Yep. That's a little BC, bit Canada, anyway. you lad, buddy boy. Just outside of Vancouver with a hunting. Oh, looks like Leighton out here, buddy. So, uh, speaking of which, are you on your way up here for hunting season? I want to make that happen, man. I really hope we can work that out. Yeah, man. That would be fantastic. Ooh, we can shoot real life diamonds. Yep, that would be great. <laughs> oh, oh, it's like, wow, really? We make a comment like that, then we go pick up a little row female. Yeah. Like this is, oh. I went out of my way to go pick up that track, and it's that. Like, come on. You're never gonna get that time back, man. That that's I'm just, not. That uh. that row deer wasted at least three seconds of my life. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, but anyway, we've got Eric from Italy, but currently in France. Am I understanding that correctly? Speaking of France, uh, nice. anybody who is from Z France, congrats on your World Cup victory. A big old round of applause right there. Yes, sir. A beard of applause. A, a, yes, a, a bearded round of applause. Or... Yes. That could get sore cut your beard in there and yeah that probably them. wouldn't be good it's not fun no uh i don't i don't like the sound of that actually ah, <laughs> bacon Dude. yeah I, I was gonna say that when i picked up a track we do have a road your buck up there we could call in uh because i do want to go through where everybody is from go is from norway kevin michael from tennessee uh, a fishful living from Washington, a defect from Columbus, Georgia, Will Miller from Massachusetts. Uh, we've got Dano UK from Manchester, UK, uh, but currently living in Sweden. I need to scroll. Let me scroll really far again. Like I, oh, yep, get it again. It's still going. 
I <laughs> know. Uh, it's gonna take so long. Wait. Uh, am I in the right place? I think so. You We've got I... Gunnaman from Sweden. What's that? I was just gonna say I love seeing uh, my home province pop up. People typing that. That's yeah. fantastic. Carry on. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> We've got Blin420 from North Carolina, Mr. Sean Johns from Texas, Keaton Harrell from Illinois, Dalton Miller from Ohio. Uh, we've got all the above outdoors from Montana in the land of the pronghorn, which he likes to remind me of every single time I see him. Hello. <laughs> That's not his email. It's you still. Uh, it is. That is very true. Did you know the 420 grain bolts are ethical on these now? On rows? Yeah. I, d right. I did not. Um, wow. Oh, there's okay. the buck. That's pathetic. It's <laughs> well, no one's ever said that's an impressive row deer. That is very true. Are you kidding? I didn't see the buck he was hiding. Wait, did I, you get it? I, I haven't been oh, using did. my crossbow, man. I guilty, <laughs> guilty admission I here. I deeply apologize for my lack of crossbow <sighs> usage. Oh, I'm telling you though, honestly, my diamond loadout these days does not include my crossbow. Does I, it not? No, no. I'm the rifle I think I'm guy. Have to do with it. You know me. I'm a rifle guy. Yeah. Uh, I'm through and through max integrity, and I know you can get max with the with the crossbow. The crossbow, I love it, but I haven't used it. I, I feel so bad. I feel, I feel like you know you've been cheating on it. You know. Yeah. Well, you are almost surely the first person to get a diamond with that crossbow, though. Yeah. I, I, Fifteen minutes out into the new update, <laughs> <It's> unbelievable. <laughs> I, I used to be quite good at it. Not to say that I'm not. I'm just rusty. Just rusty is all. But there it is. 420. Yep. I mean, that's pretty crazy. I don't even know what to say. On a road deer to yeah. boot. They changed that class because uh, it's now with the goal on the blacktail and the fallow deer. So road deer are class with blacktail. So that would be why. <laughs> oh, no, Buddha. That's only with the recurve, buddy. That's only with the recurve. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm scrolled up to continue, but I'm assuming that's about shooting blinds. Yeah, that little joke I started. It stuck. <laughs> <laughs> I'm coming, buddy. All right. I'm going to read things. We've got Benru from South Africa. Whale Prodigy from Nebraska. X01 is from Utah. Mass is from Copenhagen. Lock and Load 072 is from Pennsylvania. Uh, wait a minute. Eric is also from South Carolina. He might have been talking about something else earlier. Uh, Toneless is from Sweden. Stephen Horn is from Louisiana. Gary X from Mexifornia. Cody Karki is from Minnesota. <laughs> Chico is from Derry, Pennsylvania. Hendry is from a hospital. Uh, <laughs> Whose stream did he say that on? Was it Rex? I think it I was. I saw him yeah. say that recently. <laughs> Creative man. Uh, Tarbs from Illinois. Stace Helfrich says, same here. So I think from Pennsylvania. Um... I think I got Fishful Living from Washington. Eric is from everywhere, apparently. Ezra from Tennessee. Firefighter from North Carolina. Hybro wants to know when the geese are out for PS4. If you're in the US, I think it's tomorrow. If you're in Europe, it should be on the 19th. Uh, the Pink Freddy Plush says, just subscribe. You must be set to private because I don't think it popped up. Uh, but thank you so much, man. It is very much appreciated. Uh, Big Grizz says, so if you're running low on animals, do a three-day cycle. Do you have a video up on that theory beard, do you? Oh, well, I have a need zone video that explains a lot of that. Uh, I haven't really done one explaining that theory because i quite honest. We talk about it a fair bit. Uh, give it a try and let me know what you think and, and talk to us in Discord if you got any questions. Absolutely. Yeah, for sure, man. We are, like you guys, still trying to figure out the ins and outs of this game. We got a lot of it down, but there's some things we still don't know uh, for sure. But uh, anyway, I shall continue. We've got Jared Ryan from Durban, South Africa. Nevada Hunting from, surprise, surprise, Nevada. Hey. Uh, Carson Jones from Utah. Jonas Moore from Virginia. Buda Maxwell from Nevada. Uh Wait, now Eric is from Washington. I don't know where Eric's from. He's from every state. 
in the everywheere's. Let's go to fire. Country He's a man boy, of the world. Five, five, six, has made it. Oh, he is a man nice. of the world. Yep. Yes. Welcome to the stream, man. Thanks for coming by. Glad that you could make it to this stream. That's a bison up there. I think it's a male. I've I've accidentally glitched myself. There we go. Um. Oh, apparently I scored a little bit too far. Let's go where I'm supposed to be. There we go. Jaeger from BC Canada as well. Hybra from BC Canada. A Wolfo 100 from New Zealand. Uh, we've got Ryan Nelson saying, hey, what's going on? Hayden Burroughs from Nevada, America. Oh, the pink Freddy plush says hashtag first stream as well. Welcome to the stream, man. I'm glad you can make it by uh, on such a, I don't know if I should spoil anything, but a diamond encrusted stream. Ooh. Uh -huh. Uh, we've got Erica Faith from Colorado. Um, oh, Benru is asking, can you guys document the real life hunting? If we can make that work, we are absolutely going to do our best uh, for any of such videos and the like. Oh, that would just be amazing. Absolutely amazing. Couple uh, body cam GoPros and off we go. There you go. I just, I hope we can make that work this year. <laughs> That'd be great, man. That would be great. Anytime from September to November, you let me know if you're free. <laughs> All righty. <laughs> Will do. Uh, we've got Koi Shoop from Idaho. We've got Austin Dobbs from Austin, Texas. We've got this farmer vlogs from, from Folkstone, UK. I might have said that wrong. Uh, Tegan Lawrence vlogs and gaming from Michigan. Ryan Nelson from Wisconsin. Uh, everybody's from. Oh, I spit that bison. How did that happen? Everybody is from everywhere. Big Bubba 1970, glad to see you around, man. He is from Ohio, and hey to Anders Roan. I'm sure I said your um, last name wrong. Oh, uh, um, you found that too? Yeah. That's going to be really? very close to you. Yeah, uh, you're going to go ahead and get in front of me. I'm done shooting large animals for the day. 33.39? That's got to... I'm going to do... Oh, my, I'm not gonna do really? Um... Does anybody have a calculator to see what percentage that is? That's, I would, I would make a bet that's a level three, dude. That is, that's gotta be. 30, he's he's running this way, oh, he's, that's not him, that's a female. He's this way, isn't he? I've got running here. You go that I, way, I'll go this way, we'll get him found. Well, there's a guy right there. That's a female, it's a female. I just uh, I dude. have some tracks over here, and I did see him moving this direction, but I never saw him step out of that tree line. Oh, you actually saw him? Yeah, well, briefly. I, I was looking at him when he was by the bison. Oh, okay. And so I wanted to check the track before I said anything. I could tell it was a male, but, you know, I mean, bro. Like, uh, yeah. Okay, this one's uh, very old. I've just got feed zones here, so it's hard for me to say. Thomas Brown says, smash the like button with two hands. If you gotta do it, I think if we get enough likes, this diamond or this road here is going to be forced to be a diamond. Uh, and Wolfo100, thank you so much for subscribing and becoming a Schuster. You know, I don't think we've ever had two in one stream. No, sir. Well, we're gonna wow. now. Well, 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 well. Man, you just like know. sweat diamonds these days. I'm sweating, I can tell you that. <laughs> A little warm today. Okay, I've got another track over here. Yeah, um, I've got a few up here as well. Almighty Viper says, do you know what's better for Blacktail? 243 or 270? 243 is the one you want. That will give you integrity. 270 will not. Where did this guy go? Got anything down there? No, oh, I've got a need zone here. I just yeah, that's up. what I've got as well. But I mean, he walked to it and then the tracks of... Oh, here we go. That's a female. I just snuck right by that, apparently. Wow, well, hold on. We've got ourselves a wild flinter that's appeared. I'm going to line up on this guy. <laughs> see I do can... have some poops down here. Wow. Wait a minute. What did you say? <laughs> nothing. Nothing. <laughs> I'm gonna get shot. 
<laughs> Apparently scared the boost right out of you. Just now. <laughs> yeah, that's it's happened. Okay, so he did turn then and went back, so that's good to know. So we know we're and that, and yes. that works because wind, you know, it's a thing. Yeah, it's not perfect, but it's not bad. Are we actually gonna get two diamonds on one stream? What the heck? That would be pretty amazing. Mm. Uh, Buddha, the be. exact weight was 33.39. If you're looking at Godiga's sheet, and by the way, guys, if you have not seen it, first off, if you're not in the Discord, what rock are you living under? <laughs> I'm just saying. But our very good friend, who's a very upstanding community member, Godiga, excuse me, Godiga has made a diamond-related spreadsheet. So we got the one from Nordorf. That gives you all the integrity, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. But we've also got one that is specific for diamond information, and I'm willing to bet that that is what Buddha is looking at right now. Thirty-three point three nine. That's it, buddy. Thirty-three point three nine. I was say? trying to do the math yesterday on Road Deer for some reason. Mm -hmm. It's going to be extremely close. So close, so close. I I feel like it's a little low. Yeah, you can always get the high trophy rating for the lower exactly. weight, though, because we had the opposite on the red deer earlier. That's right. That's right. I mean, it's the combination of the two that make it all up. And, you know, we were just talking about this last night, Flinter. I'd love your thoughts on it as we try to delve deeper into these things. You know, we all know that with antler species in the game or palmates, it's it's weight and it's their, their rack that seems to make the score, correct? I think... Uh, I'm pretty sure it's just the rack. The weight shouldn't matter. Mm, see, I feel it has to do with the weight as well because when, you, when you've got that, because there's only so many examples of the rack, and when the rack's a certain size, it should always be that score. But the weight fluctuates yeah. and seems to bring it up and down. So with the likes of a predator, well, we've had the sa the predator with the same weight but two different scores. It's got to be their coat on a predator, correct? What? Godiga has told me is there's a little bit of randomness to predators trophy rating and I think it's the same for antler species I believe there's just a slight variation uh, in the size of the rack like it's scaled up like 1% say a, a 244 moose versus a 245 or something that'll get you like a 998 versus a thousand um, I think that is where that's coming from I do believe it's all in the trophy rating this okay. guy's going back this way. We've got uh, Godiga has just said that it should be about a 966. Definitely a diamond. Thank you, All Godiga. Right, Thank sir. you, Buddha. Very much appreciated. Weight does guys, not affect the total score. Trophy rated yes. is everything. I'm going to go with Godiga on that one. Uh, it was just yeah. a theory I've been working off because I've seen it fluctuate so much. Uh, yeah, I do believe it's just a small thing that you almost can't see. And guys, if that's not reason enough to join the Discord, he can pretty much tell us what roughly it's going to score. That makes such a big difference for knowing what yeah. to track and what not to follow. We just have some really talented people in our community, some great hunters. We do. Some people putting in a lot of time and effort, it, like Godiga here, making stuff just that much easier for everybody else. Uh, yeah. it, it just speaks volumes, Flinter, on, on what the sort of community we got, man. I, I've never been a part of anything like this. I, I just, it, it, mind blowing. It's truly incredible to be a part of a community like this. Like, it is by far the best I've ever been a part of. Uh, and I just saw somebody was asking, what is Jaxie's club called? Uh, the Xbox one is your bearded army, right? Jaxie Beard's bearded army. It is. Yes. I got links in and my description if you can't find it or it's in the discords. It's in discord. Yeah. I was just going to say the link to ah! your discord as well as hello. Uh, Will Miller. Thank you for the $5 <laughs> super chat. Once again, using this call to attract more bacon. Well, hopefully this road here has got some bacon strapped to his back. Well, um, maybe, maybe it tastes like bacon. I don't know. I don't it know. could be. But about the same yes, size. we have four different Discord links in the description. One is for the hashtag Team Flinter Discord. One is for the Zaggy Nation Discord. One is for this man Beard's Barbershops Discord. And then we have Unity Discord, the place where we all come together uh, and just have a good time. So I do recommend joining all of those if you're not already a member of them. There's just all kinds of good times going down in Discord. I can't even begin to describe how fun it is. Oh, so we spend all of our time in there. I mean, <laughs> that, that that should pretty much say something. There's something about it, man. Just 
Being able to jump in voice chat, being able to just chit chat, I think that's the most fun is at any point in time of day, we've got always got people chatting away. It, it's yeah, I love it. Yeah, it's just incredible. Like the size of all the communities has gotten to the point now where it doesn't matter where you're from or what time you're awake, there is somebody around to chat with. Mm-hmm. And that just that just makes it such a such a great community because of that the fact that there's always somebody on. Yeah. Yeah, it really does. And I see Country Boy has finally joined the Discord. He says Beard and Unity is next. Well, welcome, man. Looking forward to getting to chat with you in there. And now we don't have to send out public tweets every time we chat. <laughs> Where about you have the, uh, are we here? Do you have the need zone sort of glitch with this guy? Uh, Yeah. Okay. Yeah. It'll break itself eventually and we'll get him. We've still got 30 minutes. And I mean, it's a road here. He can't. He's got a small brain. He can't outsmart us, can he? Probably not. The wind is going to hurt us here. That's why I haven't bothered chirping away yet. Yeah, there's a female calling up there. Could there be a zone where he's That's hanging what out? I'm thinking, yeah. That's the f- See, man, I'll tell you, great minds think alike. Yes, sir. Quick, Flinter, what am I thinking right now? Tacos. Oh, how'd you know? Oh, man. Because <laughs> right, I knew it was right. Taco Tia Monday. Yeah, dude, yeah. Yeah, I mean, if you're in Australia, it's already Taco Tuesday, so it, it, either way, that could have worked. Yeah, well, you know. Uh, Godika says, messed up the score calculation. The score is probably 955 plus or minus 10. Well, I hope is the plus side. Uh, and hello to Stuart Cook. Thank you for coming by the stream, man. I'm a little... Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. Yes. Wondering, wondering if we should see we don't have any just now but he can't be that far unless he's trucking it because we did I saw him back there when we saw the bison do you, oh that's a female do you want to split up head down to Tishanel Lodge and I can just follow him you're going to be the one taking the shot anyway to or would Tishanel? you rather stay because well, the wind will be good I know what you're saying it's a matter of getting in front I mean, I yeah. could, and then just truck it over. Well, hold on. I have a feeling we're right behind him. Well, you um, might well be, so we should at least get over this little rise. Something I've been doing a lot of lately is <laughs> not not clicking every chat, trying to move off and sort Track? of to the side. Yeah, not, like right now we're following it where we're clicking on every chat. Well, I've been trying to give them a bit of a berth and, and sort of come around. Uh, it was working pretty good. You'll see. You'll see what, what I'm talking about later. <laughs> now this one's turning Holy anyways. Man. What? I just noticed in the chat, Bino is awake at 6 a.m. Uh, but thanks for coming by the stream, man. Very much appreciated. What is up, Bino? Good to see you, man. Right on. I, he says it's a bit too early for tacos here as well. <laughs> 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 it's never too early for tacos. Come on, man. 24-hour tacos are the best. Right? Uh, <laughs> I just happened to notice Dustin says, Hello, everybody. Did I miss anything good yet? Um, <laughs> uh, yeah. I don't know what to say anymore. Just say yes. <laughs> yes, but uh, don't leave. <laughs> yeah, you don't want to leave right now because we're possibly on the trail of a diamond number <clears throat> two. Should I, yeah, maybe. Did, did I give away too much yeah. for earlier in the stream? No, no. If you if you missed it, you're going to want to go back after the stream and watch the first, like, oh, we weren't even long into it, were we? Maybe half hour, half hour, you should it be was, good. It was 3.31, I think. We started at 3, it was 3.31 when I looked at the clock right after things happened. That was one of the more intense ones we've had. Yeah, that was pretty crazy. And then how it all ended up going down. Uh-huh. It, so it we're coming almost... up to a clearing here. Do you happen to have Sentilin? Yes, I do. This might be a do you good want to sit spot. Here and call? It might not be a bad idea. That is not a bad idea. Country Boy wants to know if Discord works with Mac. I actually do not know the answer to that, man. I do not know. I'm not even sure myself, to be honest. Uh, I, I yeah, it should. pretty big. 
thing, I would certainly imagine that it does, but you never know. This is a great big clearing. Uh, Firefighter says, it won't let me join the Unity Discord. Do you know why? Uh, it could be the link. Sometimes weird things happen with the Discord invite links. If if you're in, yeah, I know you're in my Discord. If you want to check out my info, uh, I think it's my info tab. Yeah, is where those invites are posted. I can get you the link after the stream, though, uh, if nothing else. Hey. Uh, and hey to Eisen Weisel. Thank you so much for subscribing and becoming a Schuster. You have arrived just in time man these trees are not as friendly here <laughs> i gotta no, tell you no mean trees yeah now hopefully we were pretty close behind him if he was trucking it then we're just kind of spinning our gears right now yeah i would say that is the case there uh, is. and hey to oh. gpg productions what do you oh geez no <laughs> Hey, okay, so no. so are we? We're gonna. I mean, you know what happened last time? We had a herd come up on us. We found yeah. a level nine red deer. <laughs> Actually, that's very accurate. So I'm sure the red deer's in the back. I, probably, it's, it's probably the same herd. They're coming right for me, man. They're just the beard. Yeah, they're like the uh, police escort. They just take the diamonds around the map. <laughs> we shall protect you. <laughs> Be so. <sighs> well, and there's one straggling off by itself there. There oh, is, yeah. Ah, uh, too bad. I was getting excited when I see that. It's like, oh, that's gonna be a good one. Nope. Yeah. You always hope so. Yeah. Uh. Hey. Oh. Hey to Lorenzo007. Thank you so much for subscribing and becoming a Schuster. We are just rolling over the 27,200 mark. You guys are unreal uh, today. Thank you all so much for the support. Fantastic, buddy. Couldn't happen to a nicer guy, Flinner. As I said earlier in the stream, man, not only do you make really, really good content, you do work. So... Like, honestly, I, being a subscriber myself, <laughs> thank you, and keep it up, buds. You deserve those. Well, I appreciate that, man. And I also appreciate Noah. Oh, I'm going to say that wrong. Lou, uh, I'm just going to call you Noah. <laughs> Louvier? Louvier? I, I was going to kind of go with something like that, but I would have said it wrong anyway. But thank you so much, Noah, for subscribing and becoming a shooter. It is very much appreciated. Uh, Hybra HD wants to know what the Discord is called. Uh, well, it's Team Flinter, Unity, Beards hey. Barbershop, or Zaggy Nation. All the links are in the description below if you want to join there. And once I'm gonna go with Christopher Schroeder, thank you for subscribing and becoming a Schuster. I need to learn how to say names. Ah, <laughs> uh, the impatience, the stream impatience yeah. is real. I'm starting to want to try to jump ahead of him, but it's risky. You want to stay with him? I can. Okay, I'll go. No, All right, no. cool, cool. Let me jump down to Tisha now. And I'll jump on a quad, because that's always a good way to sneak up on the animals. Highly recommend... No, yeah. no, I'm just... You know, never mind. Don't do that. Uh, Jamie McVeigh wants to know what is the best way to take down a fallow deer. I would just go with a two, four, three spine shot, or quite honestly, um, maybe the best thing is a crossbow with a 420 grain double lung shot. That'll take him down rather fast. Mm -hmm, absolutely. Uh, and it's like that crossbow is insane. Uh, Redneck <laughs> Renegade, thank you so much for subscribing and becoming a Schuster, although I'm pretty sure I've seen your name before. I don't know. He's on, a, he's on a Harley. <laughs> oh, jeez. Uh, southeast is where he's headed right now. Mad Max's Bees, thank you for subscribing as well. Actually, thank you to all of the Schusters out there uh, for being around. Who's barking at me? Female. Oh, I... <laughs> Just put a waypoint down so I had a visual reference. Then I realized, yeah, no, I don't have my POIs on. <laughs> yeah, that got me too. 
I because of the geese decoys, right? Yeah, exactly. It just got so annoying seeing those all the time, and then you're trying to line an animal up, and you got these decoy <sighs> POIs right in front of you. <laughs> like, okay, enough of that. Yeah. I got uh, comic stands. Thank you so much for subscribing. We're getting a little more south here now. I got I got piggies. Back on. Bacon. That's <laughs> three. Three bacons. Two two bacon. A level three was uh, the biggest I've seen, but I'll check the tracks on the way through. Oh, gotcha. 83. That's um, huge. <laughs> I was a little concerned that you actually thought that was huge for a second. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Stace Helfrick says, if I can remember, the 270 can take down a fallow with no problem. It absolutely can, but it'll have no integrity, so I would not recommend doing that. Unfortunately, anyway. I mean, it is always fun to shoot an animal with a heavier caliber, but yeah, you don't get those bonuses. Don't do it on a diamond. <laughs> I was just going to say, since you said that, do you want to grab your 338 uh, for this road here? And Will Miller, thank you so much for all the support during the stream, man. He says, bacon. That sound is just, I love it. Do I want to grab my 338? Uh, see what you did there. Huh? Nice. <laughs> <laughs> I has uh, a and road deer over here. You have what? No, uh, just female. Females. Oh. He is very much turning your way in. Paul, is that Leger? Uh, thank you so much for subscribing and becoming a shooter. You guys are really insane today. I really do appreciate that. Run right at you. So we spooked him in the wind. Hey, 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 hey. Stop your building. Jeez. Gophers, man. <laughs> Gophers build? I think so. I mean, beavers do. Eh. Mm, eh. True. I can't get up that. Oh, apparently those I... beavers have a Harley. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Harley beavers. I do not have any more tracks here, so I'm just going to run around a bit, try to figure out which way he went. So, just out of curiosity, do you got anything going on other than a video after <laughs> after the str That track just appeared there. That was not there. Uh, I shouldn't have clicked That's... on other animals. I could have kept that That's track. <laughs> Uh, do I have anything going on after the stream? Well, I have to yeah. get my... Just in case. Oh, I see what you're saying. In case we have to run yeah. around. Well, I just... I gotta get that video uploaded and out. But if it's a little bit late, it's not the end of the world, I suppose. I am just slightly concerned that we might be dealing with a bit of, a bit of lit. A little bit of a glitch here. My tracks are being very... Yeah, they just appeared in front of me. That's a little bit odd. All right, well, maybe I can run into it. Problem is, yeah, I'm not going to know until I'm on top of it, really. Uh, I mean, if you spook him back towards me, that's all the better, because then we can work with the wind and we'll be okay. Okay, well, as is, I'm just running straight at you. I'm about 300 out, so we'll see yep. what happens. Give it a shot. Uh, Chargers says, hey, Flinter, we are going to Cherokee, North Carolina to go see the elk herd in rut in late September. That would be so cool. Oh, would it ever? Are you kidding me? Take some video, Hearing take some pictures. Mm. Yeah. Please. <laughs> Peace. Uh, Jamie wants to know what is the best gun for a beginner. Honestly, that 243 is probably more powerful than you'd think. Uh, but once you get the 270, you're all set. Uh, I made a shot placement guide video if you want to check that out. That can Here it really is. help you out with Here it is. Oh. Running? Yeah, yeah. If I could spot it, it's a three easy. Okay, Why is he I'm going gonna, that way? I don't know. He got he got the jump on me there. He you got the jump on me, Flutter. <laughs> <laughs> it's entirely up to you, but you could go back to the lodge again if you want to have the wind better. It's funny as you said that I was already in my map. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Great minds. Yep. Great minds think of tacos. I'm inbound. <laughs> That's actually correct, yes. It really is. I mean, I'm just saying. <laughs> I'm going to stay back here just in case he ends up spooking or something again so I can keep tabs on him. You are all set. I'm not worried about it, needing to see him or anything. If you are able to even use your collar to slow him down. Yeah. I don't know if you're able to, but there was a very big clearing right there. 
I can give some toots. I just don't want to get too close because of my terrible wind. Yes. Uh, Sans wants to know if the 338 is more powerful than the 7mm. It's got more penetration and expansion. It is more powerful. It's just not as much as you might think. It's only by like 5 penetration. Uh, it makes a difference definitely on the moose and the bison, but the 7mm is plenty powerful for even the bison here. Uh, and then, why does everyone use the 7mm? That's exactly why. It gives integrity on more species. You can go all the way down to, I would say, reindeer are the actual smallest weight. And then clear up to bison, so you can just hunt so many different animals with it. And uh, Country Boys says he's got to go... Oh, Beard, you're supposed to read that part. I, 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 I don't see it, but I'm assuming it's do it with two rads if you gotta. That, yes, sir, is at the end. Yes, sir. <laughs> <laughs> oh, very nice. Okay. Uh, shoot this road here with two hands. Yeah, so I should be. That'll be somewhat close now. Yeah, you're about 300 out. I yeah, see. I'm. Big. I'm not sure that I'm to where he's spooked yet. I'm going super slow. Uh, Real Gun Selinger wants to know, what's up, just joined? Well, what's up is basically we've got a... Ah! <laughs> we've got a uh, Will Miller doing it. He says, last one, I'm out of here. Enjoy your night, fellas, and chat, have a great night and day. Thanks for hanging out, man. You have been a fantastic addition to the chat. I really appreciate all the support, Absolutely. and have a good night, dude. It was definitely a pleasure. Have a good one. We'll see See, oh, I was going to say see in the next one, but that's not a thing anymore. It's not a thing anymore. It's been retired. Oh. I like things. <laughs> yeah. Hayden Burrow says, I shoost my bow with two hands. If anybody can shoost a bow with one hand, that's actually insane. Hand and a foot? Hey, crazy yeah, things well, have happened. I suppose. Okay, Stuart so. Cook wants to know which compound bow is best. The Hawk Edge is definitely uh, ideal. It's got more draw weight. I think it's a little more accurate. I'm not actually sure about that, uh, but I definitely prefer it. And William Meyer wants to know if I've shot a piebald red deer. I did get a piebald hind. I haven't had a piebald stag. Hmm. You got anything? No. I'm, uh, I'm not at the clearing. I think he's probably pushed through it. I'm on my belly right now. I see Will is here. He says, hey, sorry, I just got out with my internet being upgraded. Well, hopefully that works out for you, dude. Or oh, what's that? That's a piggy. I'm curious if uh, it's gone down this way. I'm just kind of hanging with the tracks. I've got one heading pretty south right here. Uh, Will Miller says he is following both of us on Twitter. Much appreciated, dude. Very Maybe nice. we can hook up on there at some point. Nevada Hunting says I shoot my shotgun with one hand, but my 7mm with two. I've always hey. kind of wanted to shoot a shotgun with one hand, but I've never been brave enough to do it. Uh, and Hunter Classic, thank you so much for subscribing and becoming a shooter. It is very much appreciated. I think he went down here, dude. He went this way. I got his, just found his tracks. And he's behind me in the wind again, the dirty bagger. Mm. I was I was really trying not to move up too far, knowing that he was going to be working around like that. You might yeah. as well, well run to me here, bud. Yep, on my way. Actually. Actually? You just keep on running. Towards I'm, you? I'm bouncing oh. again. <laughs> Good call. It's probably worth it. Yeah, if I can get around uh, the other side of them, I'm just going to skirt the highlands here and try and slide on in there. Good call. I see Hybra HD says, just got my second diamond red deer today. Score was 954. Well, congrats on that, dude. Uh, and Firefighter says, bye, guys. I'll message you on Discord tonight. Talk to you later. Sounds good, dude. Thanks for hopping by the stream today. See you, man. I am not having the tracks running this way yet. 
Uh, you need to head a little bit more east, just a little more to east. Ote? You'll find him. It comes down through the clearing over there by, uh, it was a landmark or something there. By that hunting blind, I believe I was, wasn't I? Uh, okay. Sounds good. No way. Uh, just the, what? This guy's, what? You got his track there? I'm on a, oh, did I click off it? Oh, jeez. Uh, oh, I, I, I was lit on a bison track. So when you said his tracks were down there, is that actually one that you just uh, saw I'm or you picked curious up? curious now. Well, I thought that I, I didn't think I had clicked off. Um, yeah. You might have done it while you were spotting something. I'm going to head up here where I had his track and see if that goes yeah. that way. Yeah. Uh, but Jesse Richardson says, I love your videos. I've never missed one. Keep up the good work. Well, that is very much appreciated, dude. Uh, and I will do my best. This little guy's giving us the run around more than that red deer did. I'm surprised. I normally road deer. I mean, huh, you just call him right back in. <laughs> yeah. Can't say I've ever tried it on a level three, though. Uh, Jamie McVeigh, this started at 3 o'clock Eastern, so just under two hours ago. Uh, and the plan was to run for about two hours, but, uh, might be going a little over time. I don't know yet. Oh. Yeah, well, it's looking like it. I do have very fresh tracks here, so something tells me he went down here. Going which way? Mostly his tracks. Uh, southwest. Southwest? So he was him. going back. Okay. Yeah. I wouldn't mind catching him at the zone and making life way easier. That would be Wait. nice. We're right down where we shot stuff earlier. Yeah. That we are. He is actually turning and heading north, which is okay if that's actually what he did. Although... I do not have the next track. Oh, I do. Uh, GG Buke says, love your videos, dude. Thanks, dude. I do appreciate that. And Kevin Michael says, finally joined the Discord. Welcome to the Discord community, dude. Right Looking on, forward man. forward to getting to chat with you in there. Yeah, you're, uh, you're probably going to like it there. <laughs> There's a lot of really great peeps. All oh, the good peeps. I just spooked a female. But I do got him going north here, so I think we might be able to clutch this right at the end. This could be great. Yeah, oh, there's a lake here. That is either going to mess with things or make things really good. I'll let you know in a bit. <laughs> yeah, I'm coming up behind you. I'm about 200 out. Sounds good. He is not leaving as many tracks as I would like, but I've stayed with him so far. But now we're not having the glitch anymore, yeah? No, I've got just tracks. It seems you've got to spook them to get them out of that glitch. Yeah. I just had Where a road deer call. I don't know if that was warning or what. I I heard a female warning. Yeah, female warning call. Northeast or, well, not northeast from you probably. Now chances are that's the need zone over there. Yeah, he is actually kind of cutting back southwest, which is not great. Okay. Oh, well, here, maybe I can get into this clearing and spot him. Yeah, try it out, dude. I will just stay on the tracks. Yeah, I, he is heading right towards the clearing. That big kind of cliff there. Kind of looks like he's heading towards that. I don't know if I would have spooked him coming through here or not. I've been crouching the entire time. By the cave? By the landmark. Is that a cave? Yeah. Coming right out into this opening. And then... I don't really know. I don't see that he's run back through here. Bunch of tracks. I think these may all be bore. Uh, oh, see. I did apparently spook him down this way. He is just getting the wind and bolting every time. Oh. Where that boar is is probably roughly where he's at. I am going to just go ahead and fast travel behind you because I think me being in the wind is messing things up. 
Well, I'm only a hundred away from you now, so. Yeah, but your wind is probably okay. This was a need zone here for row that I just picked up. Q Q. Yeah, so he's probably come through here. I'm expecting to click his tra tracks at any moment here, but there's just a ton of boar that came through here. Yeah. Convoluting I'm just... everything. Here he is. I got him. He's coming back. <laughs> you got Good for the love of Pete. Track or his self? His track. Oh, yeah. And now I'm in the wind again, too. He's coming back uh, to no. you. Yeah, it's going straight okay. south. I will slow down then. Or should I not? Well, I think if you maybe spook him a little, you might be able to turn him. All right. About to start firing my 44 try. then. Uh, I have him as just now. Yeah, I did. Yeah, he spooked. I spooked him a minute ago there. I just shot, so watch for him to come running that way. And I did not shoot into the air on this. The bizarre off chance that I would somehow clip him. I shot the ground right in front of me. Yeah, no doubt, eh? I'll just blindly shoot into this bush and... Aw, oh, jeez. <laughs> <laughs> and, he, and here, Wait, here he is. Pushing? Here he is. Nice. That is him. He's not going to stop. Yeah, but the wind is great now. Away. The wind is good. Yeah. I'll just kind of get caught up with you and hopefully we can just call him back. <laughs> Sean John says, check those boar tracks. I believe y'all are close to where I got my diamond boar on Beard's map. And then Mass says, Sean, one diamond at a time. Yeah, that was up uh, by uh, Bondorf Hill, Sean, just around the other side. I remember that well. What a hunt that was. Oh, my goodness. Was that the one where he asked you, or he said he never gets any max level animals, then within minutes was asking yep. what a max level boar was as he spotted it? Yep. Okay, I got eyes on him here. Excellent. I shall crouch. Oh, no, that's the boar. Hmm. There he is. There he is right there. 150 out. No, he's booking it. Oh, he's trotting away. I'm going to just run up to you then if he's that far away. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Did he... No, he's... Yep. Oh, yeah. Oh, he slowed. No, he's still... Tr he... Yeah, for the love of Pete. What are you doing? Why yeah. doesn't he like us? This little guy is about a pain, isn't he? He's running out of sound range is the problem. If we can keep him in sound range, yeah. we should be able to call him back. It's just he doesn't want to listen. He wasn't responding at all to the calls. So yeah. I'm hoping maybe sitting in this clearing here, we can get him to come poke his head out. Yeah, with the wind being okay, I think it's... I think we might have a chance here. Hayden Burrow says, don't shoot diamond trees like Zaggy. I'll do my best. He nailed a tree yesterday on the stream as well with a crossbow. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Kodiga says, be careful with that spam calling. I've tested a little bit. You really have to spam call to get them to actually spook. Yeah, they don't really spook too much off it, it seems, anymore. They really did before. Where it affects you, though, is when you have them and they're coming in. They'll stop to listen every time you make a call. So if you've yeah. already got them, you don't want to keep doing it. But when you have it, grab their attention. I mean. <laughs> yeah, and the thing with the max level animals is quite often the first call doesn't get them. You have to call a couple of times to get the percentage up. That's right. Basically. Yeah. And it's, it's a strange numbers game you have to play. These trees are not friendly here in Hirschfeld. And there we go. That's not bad. Now we just got to hope the little bugger comes in. Yeah, he was trucking it pretty good. He wasn't uh, He wasn't at full run or anything. He was only at a trot. He'd calmed down yeah. at least. I'm just kind of crawling over here. I think I'll get a different line of sight and I'll be completely hidden, I do believe. I am completely hidden, which is nice. Excellent. The tree is helping me in my cause. Nice trees. Yeah. Uh, NJ Productions wants to know if I ever play a different game. Doesn't it get boring? Yeah, I play the Hunter Classic as well. I play a ton of Rocket League these days. And I've got some other games that I play here and there as well. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, yes, Godiga, I completely agree. You can scare them. It takes quite a bit to do so. We've shown that time and again on streams. I 
Bridge size. Most recent comment there. Yeah. Where are we? Come on now. He's got to come and poke his head out so we can take it off. <laughs> I certainly hope so. Uh, Brandon Lambert has just rolled in. Welcome to the stream, dude. And the Sika Hunter 123 and Bigfoot Hunter 25. Welcome, welcome. Uh, Bass Fishing 16 wants to know what is better to have, penetration or expansion. I will forever say penetration is better because if you can hit those organs, you're pretty much set. The expansion just does more damage to the organs. So in some scenarios, it is better to have expansion, but almost always I'll take the penetration. Are we going to have to follow this guy? Well, the bacon came back. <laughs> oh, hey, don't mess with that pig. <laughs> it's got a Harley. <laughs> oh, jeez. Biker pigs. Uh, the hunter C O W T R says hello, and Crad Sema says hello from Germany. Well, hello from Pennsylvania. Hello, hello, and hello from Canadia land. Well, dang it all. Right? <laughs> Who would have thought? If, if you would have told me we're going to have two diamond potential animals today, one's going to be a roe deer and one's going to be a red deer, would, and you told me one's going to take way longer, I would have picked the red deer every day of the week. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But this little fella is just about annoying. Um, Mori TG Gaming says, mouse release, how's the hunt going? Uh, I mean, it's going great. We're finding all the big animals, just this level three roe deer just being a bit of a pain. Hey, who's building things around me? Stop with the building. Stop with the building. I'm going to try and make that ridge over there. I'm going to start crawling to it. Okay. I don't I'm think just that, kind of uh, crawling my way over here. Yeah. I saw that. We can maybe spread and see if we can uh, rowl this thing out somehow. He's, he's acting like a diamond. That's a good sign. He certainly is. Uh, NJ Productions wants to know, how long do you have to stock a diamond in videos? The longest I've ever followed one... A uh, specific diamond was uh, a moose that I tracked for like an hour and 45 minutes, I think. It can take a while. I've um, had them in, in what? Oh, geez. We got a female yeah. here. A female bacon? Oh, I just, yeah, I just heard that. No, no, there's a ba bacon up there, but there's the female row. I, I heard the row walking in. I was like, no way. Did I just crawl out of cover and it's right beside me? I'm going to spook this thing, see which way it goes. They often travel uh, very similar paths. Uh, Ethan Hawkins says hello. Hello to you. And Dre Korka is here as well. Welcome to the stream, Matt. Hey, Dre Korka, one of our previous King of the Kill winners. Very nice. Indeed. Uh, Ashton Brown wants to know what is my doubles rank on Rocket League. Right now, I am champ three, division two. Where did this little bugger get to? Well, and you got to wonder, sometimes they get hung up. If he was on the other side here and couldn't get up the hill, uh, I just don't like giving them too long of a lead. That is a possibility. No, Buddha. No. No. Get out of here, Bacon. So I'm going to have to go and pick up his trail again. Wait, because what I'm... is this dead? Th I found your other road here. What? I found your other road here. Oh, that's where we were. Well, there was a need zone right there. No, that was it where was. we shot. It was a need zone. Anyhow, if uh, yeah. you want to pick that up, would be great. <laughs> I can do that. You are definitely going to need to check your consec once we get this road here. Yeah, for sure. Not going to take There's... any chances. There's piggies all around, I can tell you that. I haven't had his track coming through here. I know he ran over here somewhere. Yeah, I think he... Oh, yeah, look at that. There's... <laughs> He's laying right there. I'm going to get run over and die. This was not a bad one. 206 trophy. Oh, not bad. Oh, uh, no. No, 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 no. Ooh. I have no health. Hey! Just shoost it in the face with your crossbow. And wow. 
you got a boar and <laughs> I got something making building noises. Okay, so I'm thinking nope. this must be over, over here. Did you really? Yeah. Oh, I missed that. Uh, that would have been cool. Dang diamonds taking me away from all the fun and excitement. I know. I. Hey. Jeez, man. I am starting to wonder if this is going to be taken down on stream. I really am. Well. It is entirely up to you if you want to just come back and find them later since you've got a video to work on. But my only concern is getting the video, but I mean, hey, if we could maybe find the track here again. Yeah, I... Do you have... No, you probably don't. Hmm. He ran through, like, somewhere up here, right? Okay, I got his track here. He did come back. Okay. He did answer the call. The call of the wild. Huh? You see, you see, what, <laughs> I, see what I did there? Uh, so that's I've, pretty good. I've got split tracks. Oh, boy. Uh, that one's the old. marksman. This one's very fresh. Nice. That's where we need to be then. The marksman says, I got a 1000 elk and put it in King of the Kill. Congrats on that, dude. That must have been a beast. Very nice. Very nice indeed. He does seem to be skipping tracks here. I'm telling you, dude, I had tracks literally appearing in front of me. Uh, well. Fun stuff. Let's see. That's old. He's come through here a couple times. So he was moving in yeah, a truck. Yeah, he's, he's trying to get back to something. Okay, I'm on very fresh. You're clear to just run flat out, bud. Yep, I'm 40 meters behind you. Alright. This is where the road here dies. No more Mr. Nice Flantro. Well, we got a need zone here. Yeah. But now what has he done? Probably... Left? <laughs> huh. Looks like... Nope, that's old, so we're staying on these. You got, got one going no that way? I'm leaving. No. I've got him looping here. I do believe. But I've clicked this one. Let's see. So that was last there. Okay, so he's come this way, I believe. No. Okay. That's old. No. No. It's because there's a big need zone here, and he's huffed all around this need zone. Yeah. This is an old... We're going to have to map this out, man. This is looking like another yote hunt. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, wait. Is this accurate? No. No. See, it's he's danced around this little hill a little bit. You know what would probably, in theory, actually work? What's that? Pretty much just fast traveling away, uh, resetting the time and coming back. We could probably catch him at either this zone or one of the initial ones. Wait, is this right? We're actually getting somewhat close to evening, but... Just about. We're getting there. I'm just taking a look here real quick and just doing a big old swing around the the ring here to see if there was any more tracks that he maybe jumped and skipped to get outside, but I don't see any. I I think I've got the right ones, but he's in the drig zone glitch now where I'm getting a track on his own, so pretty much got to spook him to get him out of it, I believe. Uh, Emily Nightshade wants to know what my PB elk is. I'll actually have to go look. Grimwish230, thank you so much for subscribing and becoming a shoe Let me actually crouch 
uh, as I'm following this road here and take a peek at exactly what that is. If I can remember the buttons that I must hit. My best elk is a 970 exactly. So just looking scene side, like I got a drawn out pretty good on my hunter mate here. Yeah. And he's definitely heading back to that way. I think he's going to be actually down at this lake drinking. I think you're right. I've been going very slow and the wind is actually okay. Oh, I see a road here. Oh, I think. No? Is that him? I can't tell through the trees. I do see a road here, Buck. Which direction from you? West. And it is a level three. I've got him drinking here. Beauty, I'm about 90 behind you. All right, guys, here we go. Hey, oh, it's centers. Shut up just in the nick of time. Zero deer is in front of us. Oh, Keaton Harl just got back from Canada. Very nice, my man. Very, very nice indeed. Hey. That's it. How close are you to, by chance? About 160. Okay. I, I'm crawling because this is stupid. Well, you don't need any more shenanigans from this little guy. Yeah, I hear you. I can't see him at the crawl. moment. Oh, I do see him still. He is currently drinking. So, what is the plan of attack for you on this guy? I'm right behind you. I meant what are you going to shoot it with, basically, but. 7 mil. <laughs> I'll grab the 243 and we'll see what we can do with them. What sort of angle do we have? He's kind of facing us right now. I don't love it. Well, let me see if I can get some eyes on him here. That's a female. I can spot him in just a second. Whoa, hey, I'm going through rocks. <laughs> There's actually a bit of a tree in the way as well. We might need to call him in, which, eh, you know, can be iffy. <clears throat> Is he to the northish of you? No, west, Shame. right along the Shame. south bank. Yeah, that's what I was afraid you were going to say. We could crawl up into a good angle, actually, if we want. I can't see him yet just because I'm laying down. I never got eyes on him yet. Um, yeah. Um, I can actually... 98 meters from me based on the map and where I spotted him at. All right. I don't really know what the ideal way of going about this is at this point. Well, let me just see. Where did you see him? He's just like, there's a little pine tree in the way. I'm going to get into some brush and then stand up and see if I can spot him for you. A tedious wind. If he moves out, if we try calling him, we might end up with... Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> I see Godica says we waited for incentive to get back to get this guy. You Absolutely. are completely correct. We've just been waiting the entire time. <laughs> right there, Beard, if you can see that. Yes, I can. Oh, I'm not thrilled with that angle at all. That's what I'm saying. We all, I don't know if we need to call him in or what we're going to have to do, but I don't love that. I think um, I'm going to work the slope and get to the south of him. If you can keep an eye on him, make sure he doesn't boogaloo. Yep. I can stay right here. MSR666 says, guys who have played this game for some time now, do you know if you lost a trail on an animal, does the body disappear or does it stay there until you found it? The body will stay there until you've restarted your game. And I think if you don't claim it, I'm pretty sure it comes back alive, actually. I actually don't know that for sure. Maybe if an animal dies, it respawns. I had a mission one time. Uh, where I, it was a mission animal that I killed, and instead of claiming it, the body just despawned. Did he leave? I don't see him anymore. Oh, he was just ducking down and drinking. That scared me. Uh, so I'm not 100% sure, but if you're still in the same session, he's going to be down there somewhere.
Oh, goodness, goodness gracious. See, we can get close nerves. enough. Yeah. It's, yeah. Uh, it's funny how it just doesn't matter. Diamond's a diamond. Gives you that bit of a rush, you know? Gets you going. Yep. So you I'm can not, do it live as well? Yeah, absolutely. When everyone can see you? You know I'm what? Not, not sure if I'm going to need to go all the way. I think I might get an angle shortly here. I'm about a hundred off. Let me... Yeah. yeah, let me know when you get them in your sights and when you're ready to shoot. I'm going to drop that female for you for a sec. Already? Uh, Will Hammond says, it does. I flesh wounded elk and ended up dying. I restarted and it was in the exact same place the next time I played. Okay, so yeah. I thought they came back alive once they died if you don't claim them. Logan says they should add trail cams to Call of the Wild. That would be insane. I would love if you could kind of like scout out need zones and stuff see what's hanging out there at the times that you don't hunt it like especially at night or something would be pretty cool i think trail cams would be uh absolute great addition to the game would it be that hard for them to do i don't know well, maybe not with that third party camera they're working on <laughs> that's actually true uh ben rue says score prediction boys and girls uh let's Let's wait till there's a dead road here, actually. Yeah, yeah. Let's let's just see what happens. No guarantees no here. If it takes off. <laughs> Buddha's just being all kinds of negative Nancy right now. <laughs> Can you light it up How for me looking? by chance? Uh, I think I got to crouch up to do that. Nope, can't do it. There we go. See, I'm still, I'm kind of quartered to it right now. Yeah. Uh, with his head down, I mean, it's doable. But again, like, I mean, as we always preach, when it comes to a diamond, you don't mess around. No. Uh, what, what are you thinking? Spine shot with the 243? Double I'm, long? I'm thinking spine shot. Okay. I could try double lung, but oh, it's let me down before. Yeah. It, uh, if anything... You want to go for spine where if you mm. mess it up, you end up a little low and into the double lung. Yeah. Uh, Ryan also wants to know if a 1200 pound minimum moose weight is a diamond. If you're not using the zag tactics, it can be. If you are, I believe that is too small. Uh, Shadow Technology says they need actual tree stands you can put up by yourself, just like the ground blinds. I imagine that is coming when we do have it in the Hunter Classic. And oh my, tree stand hunting in this game, you go to a zone. I know you're going to delete the zone when you do it, but just, oh, you could just eliminate everything. I think I would deal with losing the zone. <laughs> to be able to have yeah, that, right? that would be amazing. You could uh, set it up in a place you maybe don't hunt that often and just take all the hunting pressure off the map pretty much. Yeah, I am actually quite a fan of the um, the erecting stands, the, just the regular hunting stands on the map. I have a lot yeah. of fun with those, man. I've done a few streams with it and some videos, and wow, like <laughs> it's, it's animals galore in those spots. And I know that the devs have said that's how they designed it. They place them in spots that are supposed to have you know a fair bit of traffic. Have you hunted the stands lately, though? I have not since geese. It's, no. It's, it seems they broke them since geese a little bit. Hmm. Yeah. Hopefully they shall be fixed, but after about a minute, your camouflage kind of goes away. Uh, me says, hey, Flinter, are you ever going to do a night hunt? It's so many diamonds at night. Uh, I'll probably do some more night hunting in the future. To be fair, my biggest diamond was shot at night, so... I mean that hey that would be I don't know what to say night hunting you can't do it here in real life but yeah there's yeah. definitely a lot out there ooh <laughs> Richard Wizard thank you so much for subscribing and becoming a shooter it is very much appreciated how are we looking on the angle there well I'm almost around buds I'm it's just a matter of now being able to see him there's a big rock there but I have a feeling that's going to put me real close to him don't know if I can get up on it you should be able to, I think, if you can actually get on it. Uh, Ankin 2021, how did it go with the massive red deer you guys found? I missed that part. It went uh, very interestingly. I'll give you that. But uh, <laughs> it, uh, it all worked out. Well, I 
think I'm almost in line with them here. I wonder if I get to that rock. I, I just, I want to see where I'm going to get a good, you know, when you're laying down, you can't get a good lay of the land to know where the ground's going to break for you. Oh, we're getting real close here. Yeah. Uh... <sighs> Hey to Josh Rubbo, thank you so much for subscribing and becoming a Schuster. It is very much appreciated. Uh, and Kevin3 wants to know when did I hit level 60? Oh gosh, back in November ish, maybe a while ago. And Benru says they should add an African map. Flinter promised me you were going to use your magic. Did I do that? <laughs> Where is he? He is right there. Oh, of course, there's a tree right there. I'm almost in position. I'm going to have a great Alrighty. broadside on him here, too, and I'm pretty close. Excellent. Hey, Loris. Welcome to the stream, dude. You have joined just in time. Beard is lining up at the moment on a level three rodeo. I have not shot a row in the spine in some time. I, I'd be yeah, lying like if I... Yeah, I'm a little, little a nervous. Large gun <laughs> to <laughs> any part of the body. Godega says I hit level 60 after him, so he would stay in January. Are you sure? I'll have to go back and look. I don't actually remember when I hit it. Oh, of course I can't get it while laying down here. If I get up, I'm going to be somewhat visible. Yeah. Oh, this could work out, actually. Is he All looking right. alert? No, he looks fine. Beautiful. God, this shrubbery here on Hirsch is real. It certainly is, and none of the stuff hides you anyway. It's just a pain. I know. Ah, come on. <laughs> the wind is so bad for me as well. I'm surprised he hasn't caught on to me yet. He's only 50 away. Okay, I'm just quickly check two, four, three, locked and uh, loaded. Alert incoming. Bacon. Uh, definite catch fishing. Thank you so much for the super chat. He says, "Good luck with the hunt." Well, good luck to you, sir, with your shot. Are you ready? Why am I doing that I bounce am. thing? I hate that. Here we go. All right. As soon as his head goes down. I took my sweet time lining that one up, man. Look at you. Nice. That was nicely quick. Synchronized boomsticks, my man. Yes, sir. Oh, boy. All right. Have we done it? Oh, God. That looks so cool in the stream. That is very realistic. Right there in the spine. Consec is good. All right, guys. What are your guesses for the score of the final animal on this stream? Did we just break all kinds of stream records and drop two live? Ho, 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 ho. I don't even want a chance taking a picture. Yeah, you I wanna... can send you some. Yeah, I was going to say, if you want to take one for me, that would be great. Maybe uh, get a nice little shot. This is my first row, man. I've never had a... Uh... Oh, this row's yeah. got a diamond early. Ha, <laughs> ha, he's there. Ooh, ooh, some good guesses coming out there. Some good guesses. Yeah, if I'm liking it. It is a diamond. I gotta tell you, Flinner, I don't think it's gonna be a very big one. I'm thinking low 950s, like 953. I'm gonna go 956, which is the score of my diamond must dear since those guys are so similar, you know. <laughs> Absolutely. Oh my right. goodness. Are I we ready? I have taken these screenshots. I am all set, dude. Here we go, my friends. Oh. It's a diamond baby yes. right on 950. On the mark. I'll take it. I'll take it any which way of the day. That's beautiful. Let's get a better look at this one. I mean, as far as roe deer go, that is pretty. Are you watching the stream there, Flantro? I am. Oh, boy. Right on the... 249 nuts. Ho, ho, ho. That's cutting her close, but there it is. Sorry to scream in your ears. I probably should have warned you. But oh, if you so good. It's well it, worth it. Yeah. You know what I'm like. <laughs> I get a little excited. Oh, yeah. That is awesome. Right on. Let me just click that. Accept that. Yes, sir. Man. <laughs> Two diamonds, one stream. 
What can I say, Flinter? I mean, it's always a pleasure, but I think today reached all kinds of epic yeah. proportions. We're, we're setting the standard for future streams now. <laughs> Two in one stream. Yeah. Unreal. Wow. Started off pretty dang quickly with one and then just ending with one. Oh, man. This has been incredible. Thanks for coming out to the stream, man. And guys, if you've not already, be sure to go check out Jackson Beer's channel. The link to that is in the description, and he can throw something in chat uh, so you can just access his channel that way. Uh, but yeah, man, what a stream. That was something else, man. That... <laughs> Unreal. Oh. Mass says, I expect three diamonds next Monday, Mr. Flinter. Well, we'll see what we can do. Uh, yeah. I oh. think that is just about going to do it. Congrats on your diamond red deer. Congrats on your diamond red deer, kind sir. Well, thank you much. And guys, thank you all so much for hanging out. You have been incredible today. Uh, you guys are just truly amazing. And uh, yeah, we will see you next Monday. Absolutely. See you later, guys. Right on. <laughs>